The minute I said that, so. it, like reality kicked in. I was like, oh, God. They're so, watching. We're, so we're going. They're with we're us. Going. Oh, shit. Let's go, cool, baby. We got a lot All right. back in. Good fucking morning. Uh, welcome back to the D2 podcast. Before I go around the table, um, we have some huge news. We have our first sponsor, Bash Mouth. Woo-woo! Round of applause. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah um, so, guys, go check out this company. They make energized gum. It's 130 milligrams of pure caffeine um, in each piece. So they're like a gusher. Yeah, right, they're good. Yep, so it's got a liquid center that is uh, absorbed. Was that sublingual? And then so that's the word. Yeah. Yep, and then it's uh, <laughs> absorbed into your bloodstream in five seconds, so you just get a boost of 130 milligrams of caffeine. Yeah, right yeah. off the bat. None of us. The only I've the, I'm the only one here that's tried it, so we're all gonna try it today. Yeah. Yep. Great. Or are we really? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great for training. Um, you know that that energy kick right in the middle of the gym. I love chewing gum. In the gym, I dude. When I was at the guys. Olympia, this is the shit I chew on. Freaking start of the expo to the end. Like, yeah, it, it freaking it, it works. It keeps I said it's great for prep too because yeah. it doesn't ha- like hurt any of your digestion. Like it's all natural flavoring. Uh, the one they have out right now is spearmint, and then they're coming out with their sour apple. Yeah, oh, um, dope. So follow them. Take a look at Bash Mouth Gum, uh, amazing company. And then you can use code D two for uh, what is it? It's ten percent off. Ten yeah. percent yeah. off, and then. Uh, Support the podcast, so check them out. Yeah, for sure. Round the table. We're back. Let's we're go. back, baby. Lance Hefner, we're starting with you today. How have you oh, been? Jesus. Ah, dude, it's been, a, it's been a good week. It was a quick week for sure, but uh, Memorial Day weekend, I get my, uh, this year will be my first ever paid holiday, so pretty pumped about that. Kind of rare in the training world. Hell so yeah. That's, that's super sick. exciting. Table, yeah, I get a, get a paid Monday's vacation, and I don't have to go in. That's awesome. That's nice. um, weather's been kick-ass. Frisbee golf was a fucking blast that was yesterday. Beautiful. That was so fun. You guys doubted me. I'll be honest. I uh, I said this to Devo after. You know how you put up the poll of who would win? Yeah. I'm not going to lie to all the viewers out there. A little <laughs> offended that I came in last place on you that did. voting. By like a Bro, far, how would how would I beat Lance in that? Let's let's get something clear. These guys are about 30 to 70 pounds heavier than me all the way around the table. So, uh I think I'm the I'm going to hold my athleticism. You I, guys I, are big I, stiff I, I, fucks. 100%. You guys are big stiff fucks. I, I thought you would have won. You I said that last night. You did a couple night. trees, though. You did a hit. hit a, you hit I came you in second place. You were I came in second place. Yeah, yeah, fuck place. yeah. You yes, I did. I don't yes, I did. Places. I was plus well, five. you guys lost count because you had so far above. I was above. so much fun. <laughs> I, I was plus one. This isn't a count. He ended fantastic. We're all winners. But I still want to know the places. I think it was me, Lance, and then whatever happened between you. You too, yeah. I mean, you lost a Frisbee, so I would say you probably lost. You should get a deduction just. Like that. Automatic automatically yeah. gain a stroke for yep. that, yeah. Yep. So that was a fun ass time though, dude. Oh, I got burned as shit. Yeah. You guys yeah, dude. Red red you two absorb the sun well, dude, way I'm different than we do. My God. This shirt right now, like. Dude, I look yeah, like the are, Michelin though. man. Yeah, you I burn really And I easily. just like kind of got color, dude. Y'all got red. red. But you'll oh, tan yeah. nice. It's that Polish skin, man. <laughs> is that what you are? Is that your yeah, nationality? Dude, yeah. Are you Polish fully Polish? And German. Polish, Polish and German. German. So white, white. Yeah. yeah. White, white. yeah. He's oh, like yeah. everyone in Wisconsin, part German. I feel like every feel human like in Polish. Wisconsin. Nick, what are you? Yeah. Uh, Swedish. So Swedish. Scandinavian. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's I'm Belgian and German. Well, Swedish and Dutch. You yeah. look like a German. You just yeah, you do. look like a hardcore German. Blue, blonde hair, blue no, eyes. We're, we're Swedish. <laughs> I was his favorite. <laughs> huh? I, I literally that was asked what you he did it for. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Good list. Yeah. I thought I'd be end up German, but no, I'm Irish and Italian. Yeah. Oh, you're Italian. Yeah. Who the oh, fuck would have guessed that? Huh? Yeah. Oh. Irish and Italian. Who the fuck would have known that? <laughs> well, yeah, no, I know that, but the Irish one's kind of fun. I thought that was cool. We yeah, had that yeah, in there. When my dad said he was Irish, I was just like, that's fucking dumb. Just means you know how to put carbs down. So. Fucking Italian food. Nick, how are you doing? Uh, good, man. Last seven days was awesome. Honestly, it was. it's just like everything keeps getting better because the weather, man. We were talking about it yeah, a little earlier. Yeah, for sure. Bro, and it's like I'd never like... I don't know. I, I've never had that like that quote unquote seasonal depression, you know. Yeah. yeah. But like, I literally felt like in the winter, was, everything was slower, and there was not as much as like joy and shit. Even though I wasn't like depressed, dude. It gets right. long but, like, here, dude. And just like the sun makes everything better, yes. you know. Yet like being with the, the boys makes it better. Being in the sun, good weather and shit, good vibes. Work's been good. Um, contest prep for a couple of my guys is going really fucking well. Um, You're traveling. Yeah, all you said of you July. got show season now. Yeah, dude. Yeah. I think I have like three days off in July. Yeah, that's dope. That's crazy. Yeah. But it's that's like, exciting though. That'll dude. be so fun. For yeah. the first, like, some of the trips though, like for the first, I'm kind of going out early though, because like so, because Rally's coming with me to Orlando and Houston, so we're going out early, kind of like doing some fun shit since I'm going to be so busy th- for the entire summer. Yeah. So it's like we're making the most out of it, and she likes going to shows anyway. So, 
but it's gonna be a lot of traveling. Yeah, that's like, exciting. I, mean, I think though, it would be dude. in Florida like Fuck three yeah. times this summer, bro. Oh, dude, that's gonna that's be a so blast. Fun, yeah. yeah, traveling for shows is so fun, dude. I know, yeah, I love dude. it. Dude, so fuck you mean? You, yeah. That's your job, dude. Yeah. That's your yeah. job. Yeah. It's gonna be getting cool. paid to go to Houston and fucking yeah. bodybuild. Yeah. Dude, that's gonna be nuts, man. That's but that's gonna, that's gonna be an experience seeing like Alphaly and Alpha Land and shit. Have you never been there yet? No, no. So this will be your first time. Oh, make some noise, dude. Yeah, because it's all those fucking influencers and dude, you you train a back day and just make your noise. Yeah. Dude, it's gonna be nuts. It's uh, <laughs> dude, I'm excited as fuck to go there. Like I told myself a while ago, like I'm never gonna go there. I'm never gonna go there. Yeah, dude, you hate, you hate that shit. <laughs> yeah, bro, yeah, all the mic up shit. You're gonna go crazy, dude. Yeah, I'm, I'm just, gonna train my fucking balls off there. But anyway, it's gonna be a fun time, man. I'm really excited. Um, yeah. So, what about you, Zachary? Last seven days, how was it? This week went quick. Very quick. Dude, quick, yeah. quick. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. Yeah, bro. Like, very quick. Nothing really happened this week. Everything was chilling. The work is just going as usual. Um, just looking forward to doing the podcast on Sunday. So <laughs> such a great like, time, yeah. yeah I look forward to the highlight of the week. Yeah, what this a, is like my highlight of the week right it now. It is a. Yeah. I I know you guys um work a little differently, but it is beautiful to have a three day weekend too. Oh, like there's dude, no yeah. stress so today exciting. because I'm not feeling rushed. So exciting. Awesome. I'm not like after this pod, I got fifty thousand things to That's do. Awesome. Let's move it along. Yeah, dude, yeah. Monday off, baby. There's something. There's a fucking vibe hell yeah. yeah. You know, what, dude. It's it's crazy though. That sucks because you know you hear about like other countries like recently experimenting with the four-day four day work, work week, week yeah. Yeah, and yeah, in yeah. every like statistical analysis they show publicly it shows that like the workers like mood improves dramatically yeah, their like, like yeah, their production up. in the yeah. workplace goes through the roof because it changes more from like like yeah there's a lot of salary positions but they do a lot of like goal orientation yeah, style yeah, stuff yeah so that like they're like this is we're gonna try this but like we gotta like show more production my through this time frame my uncle that lives in sweden i'm pretty sure like don't quote me on it but like he says that it's pretty it's pretty much standard oh uh, like, yeah and dude they, imagine and this imagine this and feeling he every shit week ton, like, like, and they're not allowed to work over that for yeah. you uh, that but time dude, also, bro he tells me about life in sweden like dude it's just simpler you know people are happy as hell there and like Erin traveled a lot. She she loves it. She she like says she wished she could do it more. Yeah, she yeah. spent like a year in London. Oh, um, she really? um Australia. She yeah, she studied You're abroad. In London. Yeah. I did not know that. She's wow. been she's been everywhere, dude. Wow. Everywhere. I'm like, there's nowhere else. She did uh um what's the Oktoberfest in Germany? In Germany. Yes. That's in fucking Munich, bro. Dope, That's so dude. cool. Did yeah. she wear one of the fits and everything? Yeah, she wore the oh, whole thing. Oh, I get down. Dude, yeah. she gets into that, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah, yeah. yeah. Which fun yeah, that would be yeah. to throw on a I get goofy so ass jealous. outfit and oh, fucking yeah. party yeah. with Germans. So oh, jealous. So sick. I wanted to do that in college so bad. I went to one of the meetings where like they were getting everybody signed up for the study abroad and I pussied out, dude. Uh, I was you? like, whole, oh, I did too. Actually, I was like a whole semester away. Freaks you the like, fuck out, it, dude. It was yeah. a lot, and I had just gotten Zeus like the year before, so yeah, I was yeah, like, yeah. who do I have watch him for a whole fucking semester? Yeah, and I just pussied out. I didn't do it, and now I kind of wish I did, dude. Yeah, it was a, it was a whole semester in Australia. Oh, oh, that's where you could have gone? Yeah. Dude, I applied, and mine would have been the UK, and I was like, dude, the UK does not sound like... And I should have, but no. that does not sound... Australia, though, that's, Every, that would have been fucking UK wouldn't sound sick. enticing to me. Dude, they Australia had, would be nuts. Oh, yeah. They had one for New Zealand, too. And that, yes, oh. Oh. Rings, that's where it was filmed. Damn, dude, dude that you had two nice. killer options. Yeah, and I pussied out. Yeah, oh, dude. Dude. Soft. But I you did the soft. military, though, so you got yeah. to travel. You got to see parts of the world. Yeah. I've not seen Canada. Anything great though. Not the best parts, but yeah, you still saw. You still saw, <laughs> saw that some in the US. Oh, that's saw a great question. Yeah, what's like the most like what you like the most exotic place you would say you've traveled to? It's pretty exotic. Dude, in no Afghanistan. Way. Afghanistan. Like, that's, all <laughs> that's really not it's exotic. Pretty fucking exotic. Yeah. Yeah. Afghanistan. Yeah, it's pretty sweet out there. Louisiana. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Afghanistan Louisiana. gets pretty rough. Right. That was the only one you went to, country wise, for uh, the service. Yeah, that's all. Oh, okay. Yeah, I spent thirteen months there, and that's all. I you ever do anywhere tropical? Like not. I was just gonna ask Hawaii. Yeah, I've never. No, I really? wish. Really? Yeah, I really, you hear about that one often. I really want to go to Hawaii. Yeah, yeah. dude, Hawaii. It's beautiful, so expensive though. Yeah. They have an Orkin, yeah. so I expensive. Orkin has a branch manager position open there, and I was like, oh, that'd be sick. But oh, then looking at like just, a job just looking there. at the yeah. rent, it's like insane. Probably like, like close to New York type rent. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Probably. Could you imagine? Oh, and then you're just on the island and. Plus, there's volcanoes. Everywhere. Sounds beautiful, but dude, like that's what it would look like. Yeah, that look. Yeah, like that right there. Great. Holy shit! <laughs> where would you? Where Where do you guys want to travel to? Like, where's one spot you? you Greece. Pick? 
Greece. 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 Yeah. That'd be dope. Immediately. Ireland, I would like to go to. Do you guys have any interest in seeing Egypt, bro? Yeah. I, oh, you Ooh, beat yeah. me to it. <laughs> I was just going to say. I'd love to Egypt. see the pyramids, but yes. I feel like after that, you'd kind of just be like. They have some right. pretty good uh, like culture there going yes. on. Yes. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty Egypt, sweet. Egypt has really cool yeah. cult, culture and ethnicity. Yeah. I want to see, I want to see like the great wonders of the world, the seven wonders. So like uh, the pyramids. You want to see the wall? about to be the eighth wonder. What? What's the eighth wonder? You. you. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I, and then I saw I saw the uh, Grand Canyon. That was fucking Ooh, dude. Nuts. Grand Canyon, <sighs> bro. It, it takes. I your, haven't even done anything in the takes, U.S. I'm realizing it takes your breath away. <laughs> yes. I've done nothing, dude. It's insane, dude. When you, dude. it's like not the best national park to go to because it's just so packed and so touristy. Oh yeah, for sure. But when you walk up and have that first like sight. And you're just like, holy! Yeah, yeah. is it it's just fucking breathtaking? Lance, yeah, Lance, it is. You you have never seen something like just as, like in you, you just get put into awe. Like you it can't, just like, can't talk. It just goes on, dude. Yeah. See, I gotta get me some of that in life, dude. We I hike, haven't we even been around down. the U.S. That's like probably what eight to ten hours away from here. Yeah, um, hell I'd, no. say, I'd say it's a no. two day drive. It's it's a, two days. It's a, well, if you stop, and it's, if you it's stop, it's like thirty hours. Oh, we did. We, we went down there two days, but we were also we were stopping. And we like stayed night at places and shit. Holy like, shit! Yeah. yeah, we went there with my family. We went to Arizona for. Fuck, it was like a week and a half. Like we camped in the Grand Canyon. Wow. Yeah, like same, I'm talking. Like I've same. seen. Really? I, yeah, yeah, I did that. Too. It's absolutely insane. What? Yeah. So spring break, That's probably just senior year spring. Right Can we do that? That's Fuck, nuts. senior year, senior year spring break. Uh, instead of going down to like party area, yeah, we were like, let's do something different. So we went to Utah, or we went to Colorado, Utah, and then ended in the Grand Canyon. Utah's beautiful. It back. Dude, I've Ar- heard. Arches, I've heard. Arches in Utah. Yep. If you ever get to go to Arches National Park, I've been there. It is. Just like the Grand Canyon, like yeah. They, these huge arch, like rock formations, you can climb them. You're like the hikes are incredible. You're just out in the mountains and desert, and it's pretty crazy. And like you, there's so much wildlife out we there. We camped dude. the whole time. Like, too. dude, I've seen cougars. I've seen fucking yeah. elk, moose, fucking. Oh, dude, we were camping like in the Grand Canyon. We have to hike at night, okay? Because it was so hot during the day in the canyon. Yeah. So we'd be hiking at night. And we would like chill throughout Seems the day. It's dangerous, dude. It's, yeah, and dude, it's crazy because if you're up oh, at yeah. the adrenaline rush, if you're adrenaline. on the lip of the canyon, <laughs> dude, if there's a cougar in the woods, if you're on the lip of the canyon, it. it's like say it's like sixty degrees. Yeah. If you're at the bottom, it's like hundred and ten. Yes. Yeah. And dude, we were like we'd be hiking at night, and it's still like fucking 70, 80 yeah. degrees because like all that rock insulates it. So now yeah. it's just a heater. And then, but like, dude, we'd be walking, no lights because the moon is so bright, and you just see like rattlesnakes slithering in front of us. Hell like, dude, you, no! I'm not, I'm not kidding you, bro. You hear you these fuckers? Me, and you lost me. Dude, right one of those crazy. No, nope. when I was in when I was in uh, <laughs> Arizona, this was when I was dieting, like before my show, when I was at that worst phase ever. Oh Jesus! I was dieting through this shit, dude. We oh, did you terrible. hike to the bottom? Yeah, yeah, you did that. Like, yeah, eight, we did. We would uh, like south, north, no, south to north rim. Camp, oh, like, nice. Hike, like, yeah. like what, as, as we were camping. Yeah, yeah, that's what we did too. It's the, pretty sick. The North Rim is really, really pretty because it's like it's more uh, woodsy and like more yep. like mountainous hills, and it's like it's not as populated with tourists. Yeah, uh-huh. and like that's no one can. Yeah. None of these fat ass Americans can no. make it all the way over there. That's why it's so peaceful. <laughs> yeah, like, that's why one. Yeah, yeah, that's why the other end where all the tourists can't get to Literally. is peacefully. Dude, like, you don't see oh, you don't chilling. see nobody up there. Yeah, yeah. God, dude. Yeah. It is beautiful, man. <laughs> they get to the lip and they go, "Wow, it's beautiful." And they back in the car, ass right back, around. back to the cafeteria. God, that makes sense as to why <laughs> my right family hasn't done that, dude. Because I can't imagine my mom proposing that idea to my dad and him being like excited about that. You guys ever been right. out west, like to the western states? No, I've been like I, nowhere. I went to Seattle. Oh, okay. That'd be I've been to cool. fucking Colorado. Seattle, Se- I heard that's the pretty cool. Is rough. That's it. Yeah. Oh, Otherwise, really? it's yeah. cool. Yeah. Just a we ton? went to the fish market where they like. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's I've seen YouTube videos of that. Really cool. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we went but out west when I was in eighth grade. Yeah, yeah. Out west, like in Where'd you uh, go? Wyoming, Colorado, Dakotas, um, Montana. Oh my God, Montana's fucking beautiful. Yeah, Damn, I love Colorado. Colorado. Yeah, Colorado's awesome. Yeah. Isn't that Wyoming. like what you're thinking too? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wyoming's nuts. Where dude. have you been, Lance? Fucking nowhere. Really? So uncultured. Wisconsin. Have so you ever uncultured. been outside of? Have you been like before Indiana? Florida? Had you left Wisconsin? Yeah, but like not much, dude. Oh, like, no, oh, yeah. I haven't really like I never did like a spring break in college. I dude. never did like anything like we that. We did outside the Midwest, same. eh? We did some. No, I mean I've ones. like we did like a choir trip to New Orleans in high school and that was super cool. And then we did another one to uh <laughs> fucking nerd. No, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> um, we did a glee guy. trip to dude. uh <laughs> Hey man, a lot of people the, don't uh, know the that. Men's side. core oh, ensemble went to a trip. Hey, I was really good. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was good at singing. 
<laughs> Dude, I sucks. like to say. I always say that to people. I'm just like, if I had to pick, though, my parents get pissed at this answer. I'll be like, if I had to choose between being a way better athlete, not being a little fat fuck in high school, and being good at like musicals and shit, I would have traded the musicals to be good yeah. at sports in a heartbeat. Yeah. Yeah. It just is always oh, a. Yeah, it dude. was a blast. Don't yeah, get me wrong. It. Like we it. like we put on, we sold out shows and shit like that. But at the end of the day, I'd rather wear a jersey <laughs> on a Friday. Those shows out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> fifty thousand seat theater. Dude, nah, dude, sold we out. killed it. Nah, dude, we won a ton of scholarships. Our high school for like chill. We got a ton of shit after we did Shrek. That was That's a big sick. turnout. Oh, dude, After yeah. we did Shrek. We did. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was donkey, dude. Yeah, it was a blast. You were donkey. I was donkey. 100%. Oh, yeah. Can you, a donkey voice Can right you bring... No. Yeah. Was it recorded? Yeah, my mom has all the tapes. We need to watch it. Wow. Yeah. My younger sister played donkey in their, their Shrek. A blast, cool. dude. A fucking hoot. But the makeup's ass. That part's just super... Oh, yeah. That oh, sucks. Yeah. <laughs> dude, because like I was already hated it, and then they were just like... Did you have to put a costume on? They, oh, dude, I'd sweat. Oh, fuck yeah. I sweat balls oh with the hooves, dude. The hooves. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, dude. You don't know you like very rubber many choir people and like, like that, yeah. yeah, musical oh, wow. guys. Yeah. Well, yeah. no, dude. Because it's fun hearing the stories. Well, God. I was part of musical in high school too. Which right? one did you do? I did. Which one so did you do? My freshman year. Send up. My mom thing? was like, "Dude, our school, <laughs> our school is like <laughs> the fuck into they do that shit. Like our musical program is fucking nuts." But uh, my mom was like, after football season, she's like, "All right, you're either doing like she was like on my ass. She's like, you do a spring sport, or you're gonna do the the, the crew for the musical." So I'm like, what the fuck? I don't want to play basketball. I don't want to fucking do track. Okay, so I did the musical. I'm surprised you didn't do track. Yeah, I thought you'd you would for sure. Like no, I did, I did both. You look like a both. shot put type of guy. Yeah. No, I ended up doing both. No, he looks like a sprinter. No, I ended up doing the musical. <laughs> the spear? I, no, the sprinter. <laughs> I used to be a sprinter. I used to, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But then I'm like, I get to the musical like the first day. Dude hands me a fucking sheet. I had to like fill it out and stuff. And it was for the cast. So I f- was on stage. Wow. This first musical. I was like dancing with girls and shit. We did Cinderella. Nice. Yeah. And then three years after that, I was. No, we no, never did that. I was, I was, but I was doing the ropes and stuff because I liked it. I liked being backstage and like pulling all the. Oh, you down. did like the I side shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. You need I applied people. for like all stage that. Management. Yeah, you have yeah. to have all that. I thought it was fun. I, I thought applied, it was great, dude. Great I applied time. for all that and I, I didn't get selected for even the backstage guys. Oh, really? That's yeah. surprising. Dude, I they could always on, use a help. I had a headset on everything. I was yeah, running they, that bitch. They look. Oh, you were one of yeah. I had Ariel's tape, bro. I knew exactly. I knew exactly how to like how these scene changes were coming off and shit, and I know like where these like big props were going, like rolling a piano off stage so i like taped off little fucking squares of like for the the actors to stand in like you yeah, do yeah. not fucking move from no, here yeah, yeah. i need to go this way i need yep. to go this way and then people are taking all this shit off you're gonna get hit by a fucking piano yeah, he and was then, meant to be a the dude, whole stage a i was i was i had it organized up, yeah. back there and it was yeah. fucking awesome he was conditioned to be a prep coach absolutely yeah. like that right there like <laughs> guiding just, the whole just fucking let him play. into it dude, yeah. literally putting people in little boxes no, that was the funnest time, though. That's key. That is fun. Yeah, I didn't get selected for any of that shit, man. That's crazy. It's, I, yeah. I, it's like, kind of surprising. I remember like going in there like, you know, what what did I get? And they were like, oh. <laughs> Imagine they look here, at him. Here. You're going to be tree they, number seven. They go, <laughs> they go. I thought you told him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, told me what? They're like, you didn't get, you didn't get shit. Oh. You, they go, cruise filled too, dipshit. Get out of here. You know, <laughs> that's how I felt at least. Um, but yeah, I didn't get selected for any of it. That's and I rough. was never really interested in it. And then one time I took, I was like, you know what? Sounds like they have a fun time. Yeah. You know, all those meet all those, some new people. All those people are pretty fun. Yeah. And then uh, they were a riot. Yeah, I didn't get kind of dicks too, though. I'm not kidding. Yeah, dude, for they sure. would talk so yeah, much shit. Yeah, for sure. I'm <laughs> not going to lie, dude. Like my fr- the amount of times I heard them talking shit about my friend group, I'm like, what we fuck? Dude. That's right. what they think of us? I originally went to college for music theater. That's what I initially went as a freshman at Whitewater to. Shut the I, fuck dude, up. Dude, so no joke. Way. Come a long way. Dude, I'm telling ta- Yeah, I changed into Kinesis. But yeah, um, on the first Thank day God. of class, I was like super hungover because I knew one of the seniors and I would partied the week prior. Yeah. And uh, I get there on the first day of class. I'm in a fucking, <laughs> this is when I'm like 145 pounds, like skin and bones, like just lean. I'm wearing a baggy fucking Air Jordan t-shirt, like baggy fucking Under Armour shorts over my kneecap, <laughs> flip-flops hung over. I walk into class, every dude, I swear to God, in a dress shirt, like a nice, like like a nice I ass, can, like oh, going yeah, to church, yeah, yeah, going yeah, to yeah. like a very serious very outfit. Preppy. All the girls were in dresses, and then they're going around, and the teacher's like, I want everyone to say their favorite like actor, actress, like performer, and everyone's saying people from like Broadway and like European tours. He gets What'd you to say? he gets to me, he's just like, What about you, young man? I was just like, 
Chris Farley, man, big fan. <laughs> and everyone, <laughs> and, he, and he actually looked at me. He's like, I really like that answer. And I was like, Thank you. Let's go. <laughs> I like, could just like my people, dude. I, I could tell. Them. I could tell everyone in that class was like, Fuck this kid. That's and something. I was yeah. just like, <laughs> Dude, I, I like I liked yeah, theater, but I also was... liked going to parties and I liked yeah. going to like sporting events. And like for them, it's like that's it's it. Different. Yeah. And it's like you can be like a hybrid. You don't have to just like live and breathe playing your piano when you yeah, fucking yeah, get home yeah. in your free time. That's how they are, though. They are. Dude, all yeah. of them. They it's live like, for it. It's constant, twenty four seven, baby. Dude, we're morning. on it. That's why, I, that's why I dropped out after three weeks. I called my mom and I'm like, dude, everyone in this program's a fucking asshole. Dude, one time, so <laughs> from my hometown, this guy in the musical, everybody thought he was like Goody Two Shoes. Okay, like great fucking actor, awards and stuff. He painted the side of a bus one time. Fuck all pigs. To cut the about oh, the cops. Oh my god! So that's what, I was, and then my like my dad was like talking about it, and like he was the one that fucking got arrested for it. Everybody thought he was a fucking good kid, and then he just did this on a massive bus, that's and we're like, wow, this kid. Uh, uh-uh. yeah. never. They never put him back on stage. <laughs> we have a snack of the day. We're gonna rate this shit. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're doing so, this now. The Quest cookie. Hold on, before yeah, we let, eat it, let him describe it. Um, we have these Quest cookies. Um, we wanted to do a little rating of some of these health snacks and other variety of foods and stuff like that so we grabbed uh quest frosted cookies birthday cake flavor um total fat seven grams total carbs 10 grams protein five grams uh really soft yeah milk proteins caseinite sodium uh just a bunch of random other shit so they sound all right. Uh, it's the potassium. Yeah. You want another potassium? <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> let's, just, let's just get in. Yeah, yeah let's get, uh, let's get that micronutrient profile ratio. really quick. 40 like, milligrams. Uh, we need to get our electrolytes. Calcium, 40 milligrams. So try it out, boys. Let's see. Right, are we so Are we going We're going out of solid. 10, right? We're this going out of really 10 solid, for a score. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. This looks really good. Presentation's all right. Presentation. Yeah. One bite, everybody knows the rules. Smells like a protein shake. I'm pretty excited about these. They look bomb. Yeah, they look chill. What do you guys think? First thoughts. Just hear a bunch of chewing. <laughs> this is not ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> Did, you take a bite? Did you take a bite? No, not yet. I'm waiting for someone to talk. God damn it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I can't just have four of us yeah, going at air. once. Yeah. <laughs> if I had to go like an overall score hmm. for like a protein snack compared to like every type out there. Yeah. I would give this like a five. What kind of fucking score is that? Hell no. A five? Five or six. This is pretty good for protein. He's given whole numbers. Yeah, there's not How even much that. protein you have again? You ever fuck that five. up again? Five. <laughs> you put a Almost decimal five. in there. <laughs> really 90 calories for this shit, huh? Five, six. 90 know, calories. I'm not, I'm not a huge fan. 10 carbs. Oh, I do. Seven grams of fat. I'd give it a... I'd give it a seven, three. Wow. No joke. I was just about to spit 7.3. Seven, seven, yeah, that's I'll a say, great answer. I'll say 6.5. Oh, so now you're going to change it. 6.5. Uh-huh. <laughs> now I'm you're going to change it? I'm not going to answer that. I need to eat all of it. I'll go 7.3. Yeah, that's that's a good, I'll go. I think okay. that's a great rating. It's, it's got good the texture. texture. Not bad. No, it's soft. It's not sandy. And that's the thing. It's yeah, not like yeah. a protein-y where it gets yeah. kind of like The icing's kind of a nice touch. The icing's cool. Yeah. Frost or the sprinkles too, bro? Fuck yeah. Presentation helps with it. Fuck. 7.3. Yeah. Oh. I actually thoroughly. Quest did a good I job of this. I'd buy this again if they uh-huh. if you could like buy a big box of it. I would. Yeah. Okay, now that I finish the whole cookie, cookies. now that I finish the whole <laughs> cookie, I'm gonna give it like a six point eight. You just kept climbing up. Wow. You know what? No, we're erasing being... that one. If anyone heard that, that doesn't count. You don't, don't get fucker. three different I scores, to, dude. I needed to eat the whole cookie. That's why you take your time. You think about it. You <laughs> think about that answer. You just tossed a five out there. You just said five. He said three. He went right five, bat, six, and then goes. You know what, gentlemen? After further evaluation, <laughs> a six point five is exactly what I'll give it. <laughs> no, six point eight. Now, next week you get one. Yep, yeah, one bite. <laughs> it, at the start, it kind of like tasted like a like a soggy protein shake. It literally did. It what? Yeah. <laughs> right. Then I, I started I eating it, and then I was like, mm, I thought it was kind of enjoyable, dude. That they nailed the birthday cake yeah, flavor. Kill those. We were and the texture is what saves it. Did they have other flavors? Yeah, they had chocolate, and then they mm. had another one. I thought that kicked ass. Yeah, that was really good. Yeah, I wasn't bad at all. I'd murder a box of that. They're getting so fucking good at that. Good at that shit. Yeah. Yeah. Quest has the chips. Quest is dangerous. Yeah, yeah. I haven't had the chips yet. We'll have to. Dude, get um. I saw a TikTok where a dude took the um the taco flavored ones, and he like made like a a protein taco bowl with like ground beef, the whole nine is like nacho platter, and I was like, that's super smart. I watched a guy do air fried chicken. And the breading was the Quest oh. chips. He like bashed the Quest chips up and then put it in the egg and then put it in the chips. 
So then what? The, you uh, think that's good? Yeah. That'd be oh, good. Yeah. yeah. So, so the skin was like Dorito. Oh, no. Nice. Quest Damn. Doritos or whatever. Look at us. Sounds Look at the world. Fire. Get more and more creative. More yeah. and more healthy. Ah, that's uh, not an idea. Well, don't we don't so know. Don't be too optimistic. There's gonna yeah, be. Yeah, it's getting Don't worried. be too optimistic. <laughs> Say, yeah. There's gonna be People a fallout big. from these. Yeah, we yeah. don't know how. Something with guts. This is new. Yeah. You know? Yeah. These are new, so we're the first generation that's going to go through it. We're going to find yep. out how much cancer this yep. is going to cause. Dude, all these chemicals, all the gun ah, issues dude, we're going to have. Yeah. Dude, fuck it. Uh, right. 90 calories for a sugary ass little <laughs> cake. Yeah. It's delicious, though, dude. So, yeah. you know, yin yang. No, it's fun while you're here. Yeah. For sure. And the energy drinks. I mean, oh, are we going to review bro, those? Yeah. Energy drinks, I'm, I'm curious about that shit. Yeah. Dude, just like, dude, there's, how can they make something? In you like, know oh, that's not good can. for you. A tall ass can. That good? 10 calories. Full of flavor. Dude. dude. And like, what? Um, I don't know. It doesn't I've make seen sense. Videos. I'm not going to stop drinking them. No. Fuck never. No. Never. Dude, never. Hell no. I, I, know. Like, I, I go like through they phases. Try to make them taste too I do too, too actually. Good. I'm going through a phase right now. I feel like they try to make them taste too good where people will like want more of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, for more. sure. Well, that's the objective. Three yeah. Four cans You're of addicted. Type shit. You're yeah. Have you had some sure. of those 3D energies? They're oh, delicious. It's so good. Ah, oh, dude. What's your favorite flavor? The red, Code Red. Oh. It tastes just like Code Red Mountain like Dew. I like the red one, the green one, the red, the green one, and the red, white, and blue one. I like the color blue. The blue one's good, yeah. too. Blue raspberry, is that your yeah. go-to with a lot of flavors? A lot of flavors. I think yeah. the pink like, one's yeah. my favorite. It's like sunny, Ooh, always sunny. One good. I think the pink I just one. want blue. No, the pink or the gold. The pink or the gold's the my favorite. The white one's good. Dude, the, the new pink monster, the straw, strawberry. <sighs> Dude, yeah, that one's That fire. one's really good. I really good. like that one. Really good play, for, uh, you, you gave profile. it an eight. I gave it a nine, yeah. I thought they no, killed it. No, I gave it. it lower than that. I gave it a seven Oh, did you really? Seven Yeah, yeah. I thought it was really good. It's still got that That's, monster aftertaste. Yeah, they all do. It has that signature flavor, so every one of them has the same aftertaste. You know what's sad about that, too, is their signature flavor at the end that you get that last little zip. That's the part that tells you it's unhealthy. Oh, yeah. dude, like, big time. The way like that tastes, you're just like, I bet if I poured this on like a stain, I could. Did we ever go <laughs> over? Did we ever go over favorite energy drinks? Uh, we did last week. We talked about it. Yeah. Did we? Oh, okay. Actually, I muddle all our conversations. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that was on the. Pod I don't know. I don't. Yeah, seriously. Was, <laughs> we talked um, too much. It's like it's always sunny. I panic. I'm just like, go back to the list. Yeah, <laughs> dude. I <laughs> always reach for a monster if I'm going on a drive somewhere. This is like I always it tend is, to reach for one. Okay, that brings me to another thing. It's uh, it's like you it's if you're going on a road dependent. trip, you got to stop at Quick Trip. Oh, Fuck yeah. What, you, what are your stop. what's your go-to drink and Ooh. what's your go-to food? Dude, this, Devo, this something so similar is in my notes. Fuck. Oh, okay. is it? Yeah, literally. Okay. Do you want to wait or No, 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 no. no we'll we'll do it right now. We're here now. What's your yeah. Quick Trip stop? Yeah. It's like if I'm going on a long road trip. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Your road trip go-to's for I your always, drink and your food. For I need an energy drink and I'll either get I don't think waters count, do they? No. No. Okay. Waters don't count. So I'll get an energy drink. It'll Which one? probably Which one? be the the ghost sour patch. It'll be one of those two. Yeah. I always get those. I, d- I don't know what it Solid. is, but I always look for those as my first one. Yep. Uh, Same. It's the can. I, I don't think, know why. Yeah. Sure. The See cans? the yellow and blue and you're like, yeah, nice. Like, oh, <laughs> dude, it's a refreshing it look. Yeah. You just want it. Yeah. Love it when you it's know soft. the taste when you just yeah. look at the can. So it'll be one of those. And then I'll, I'm a huge fruit punch guy. You are. I love you are. Great. It's very refreshing. I look in the fridge and I see yeah. a Hawaiian punch, like one of those tall, big oh, ones. Oh, yeah. Wow. I'm not like that, but I'm yeah. Me neither. Yeah. Yeah. We drove to Nashville and I, I got like two of those. <laughs> okay. So what's your, <laughs> what what's your snack? Yeah. Uh, snack. Probably the Glazers. Glazers. Really? Chip. Oh, yeah. You I went could, different routes I'll than I went box. on everything. I'll eat a box. Dude, same. I'll yeah. eat a box. And Bosco cheese sticks. No shit, with dude. Ranch. Those are really with good. Ranch. With ranch. Every time I see someone get those, I get jealous because I never get them. And then I'll see them oh. eating them, and I'm like, God, that Bosco oh, cheese sticks. So, so, so these like in the, the heated area. You know, like trip? in high school when you had, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, in high school, like this, the lunch that was like the pizza sticks. Yeah, right? oh. gas. That's basically what it gas. is. It's just gas. like a breadstick filled with cheese. And got they it. give you like either ranch or marinara. Yeah, you yeah, always yeah, got yeah. double yeah. that day. You yeah. always paid double for oh, those. Oh, for sure. Because yes. they they'd give you the four pack and you're like, that's not enough. <laughs> <laughs> but literally. But they have them at Quick Trip and every I will never buy them. But then I when I see yeah. other people eating them, I'm like, yeah. God, that's a, there's this damn one it. other <laughs> candy bar too that I just found and it's really good. It's the Reese's one with the Reese's pieces in the in the candy. Oh bar. no, I think you, go, oh. you just go sweet. Yeah, sweet. dude. Oh, holy dude, shit! Sweet, I don't yeah. get a candy you, bar at the damn, gas station. Really? Damn. Never. You at go, the gas who station. Do you think it likes Never. The, who's who's more of a fucking fiend for sweets? Lancer Zach. Oh. 
and Ooh, stuff. He's more candy. Yeah. Lance and is a female. I'm bakery. He's, I'm he's bakery. A yeah. I'm bakery. I'm a whore for muffins. he's always munching candy. I think I would, I would go with you. Yeah. You always are down for sweets. I love sweets. Like if you, yeah. Ice cream, all I, of it. I have to have a healthy yeah, balance. Yeah. Like if I have too much sweets, then I'm right. like, I don't want any more. Yep. And then I'll go straight salt. Like I need to have something Same. salty or savory. Same. In between. Crumble is like one of my like things. Yeah, we're gonna be like, we're gonna be rating these uh, uh, crumble each week. Yeah, if we can get a that'll be our in between yeah. between these. Um, Zach or <laughs> Nick, what's your uh, go to quick trip stop? Um, almost religiously is gonna be a white monster, and an outright bar, nice, and then nice. a uh, protein shake. Wow. Almost religiously, every wow. single time I go up north. Wow. And when I leave north, yeah. yeah. I'm just a fat fuck. What do you get? <laughs> I, bro, I don't like no, no, dude. I don't like snacking, or I'll get like an icy or some shit with my monster. Damn. I don't like snacking when I'm driving. Uh, okay. Oh, you know Lance, what would be fire? Hands, get all if you fucking... put monster in the slushy. Oh, dude, that'd be maybe. Good. Yeah, I would just want a don't pre-flavored. That'd be good. God, that's some fucking answer that like an Damn. eight-year-old would dude, say. He makes to his all his food. <laughs> he makes his all his food too. So he makes Jesus his drink. Dude, that's like when you're like ten and you're just like, Ma, you gotta see what I just made. Yeah. And she's just like, What is it, sweetheart? I mixed in white monster in my have... blue slushy. Yeah. And she's just like, That's she goes, great, sweetheart. Just, Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna have too much energy. You're gonna so love it. Sugar and caffeine. Slow down. I love. The alcohol slushies too. Oh, those, those are fire. Those oh yeah, that's like those. a margarita. Yeah. That's fucking. So or like a strawberry Baja daiquiri. Mm-hmm. Do you yeah. guys ever do a tequila and Baja Blast? Yeah. No. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Never even heard of that one, dude. We did it in high school, and <laughs> that was we went really? to Taco Bell and we get the Baja Blast and then just put the vodka in there, and it was so fucking good. Wait, that tequila or vodka? Dangerous. Both. It really? On the day. Oh shit. It depends on what we could get, you know. Yeah, you, yeah, you yeah, don't yeah, have true. full access to yeah. whoever runs you something. Lance, what, what would you give for a uh, quick trip stop? Dude, that's tough. I'm hoping it, you're it's more aligned with me. Code, we'll it's it, like totally dependent on like how long is this trip, or is it just like a casual like Saturday night? Let's and I'm say getting two gas. plus hours. No. Oh, like you're going for a road trip, yeah, road yeah. trip. Um, if I haven't eaten that day, I'm probably gonna grab like a couple chicken sandwiches. There we go. Um, they I have knew it. they have like a sweet honey mustard sauce at oh, Quick yeah, Trip that do. like we went to a Packer game one time, and he's like, try it, and I was like, okay. And I put it on like two of my chicken. Say, dude, you can just like down those things. Really? I'll get like it's two insane. of those. Um, maybe even like an egg croissant breakfast sandwich. Yep. Grab like a black dude, coffee. No. And then I'll get like <laughs> two of those like chocolate Fairlife protein ones to end it. So I don't feel like I agree with that the last fuck. two. I agree with the last two. But that dude, dude I need wait for it. Wait for that. it. Wait for it. What? <laughs> He's coming. Bro, you guys are fat. You think you're mad now? You guys are fat. <laughs> that's, dude, that's what I was like. You guys. Did not give the answer I thought you'd give. Really? You guys, your answer, dude. S- something along those lines, yeah. like something so, sandwichy, dude. Quick get, trips, slap. I get a monster, <laughs> then I grab my, <laughs> then I grab a chocolate milk, so probably the Fairlife, and then I'll go over to the hot heat section, and mm-hmm. I'm gonna grab two chicken sandwiches, yes, uh, maybe two breakfast sandwiches, sure. chicken is maybe a breakfast soak. <laughs> it's so fucking the bre- dude. The breakfast burritos are insane. Oh. Nick's just disappointed over and here. Then they have, <laughs> shoot, I am. Dude, then they have the chicken tenders that come with the fry, the waffle oh, dude, fries. Are so what? Good. Yeah. Dude, oh, good. I You bet. guys have a full meal when you're driving. Hey. Dude. Yeah. Dude, yeah. No <laughs> dude. But driving this calories is- don't count. <laughs> they don't exist it's like drunk what six happens, don't count driving calories what don't happens count. between that road trip is it doesn't it just doesn't count <laughs> dude, it's its own, that's hey it's it's, it's own like multiverse timeline it, it is, is dude. it is that's what i always used to joke about dude, if, dude. I eat, if i eat a full meal when i'm driving it's gonna be something i made like every time like or it's not or, gonna be Culver's or something. No, 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 no. Oh, or, I, well, I don't get Culver's when Jimmy I'm Jimmy John's. No, dude. Jimmy if I John's? if I get any food like a full meal that I did not make, it's gonna be definitely Chipotle or like Qdoba or some shit like that. Don't you love that's just a bodybuilder? Like there's just dude. something I can't, about I, just, I have to have, I made it or it's something food, like that. I don't know what it is, but like just knowing you're going on a road trip, I don't know if you guys have this, but you almost kind of like it's nostalgic. A, it's a terrible mindset to have, but like I'll be like, oh, I'm good. I guess I gotta be on the road for too long. Well, I should at least eat. It's just yep. like I could just make some ground turkey and rice right before I leave, but I got all my shit packed, and I'm like. 
probably running late, and I'm like, fuck, dude, I got to go. And I'm like, ah, I'll get to go to Jersey Mike's, grab a sandwich. <laughs> dude, it's, it's the best excuse. You're just like, oh, yep. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dude. You're just I like, ah, oh, I mean, I guess. I can't starve. <laughs> <laughs> I can feel my muscles getting No, dude, <laughs> yeah. You tell yourself, you're like, well, your coach would rather have you eat than not eat. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, literally. That's <laughs> literally how it goes. <laughs> so Culver's it is. Yeah. <laughs> At least there's protein. And in then it. when you pull up to the event, you like bitch about it. You're just like, yeah, I had to fucking get like two bacon cheeseburgers. And it's like, <laughs> <I'm so laughs> like it's like, well, like shit. in the back of my mind, it's just like, you didn't have to. <laughs> Dude, those you sandwich- fat fuck. Those, sandwich- <laughs> those sandwiches from Culver's don't fuck you up in the stomach, huh? No, they totally no. do, dude. <laughs> no. It's worse. <laughs> Iron stomach. <laughs> Iron stomach. Wow. Yeah, you're oh. and you can He's gu- a tank. You can guzzle those things. It's like two bites. Dude, oh, yeah, sure, you're just sure. licking like your chips. fingers at the chops, <laughs> oh, dude. Oh my gosh. Those sandwiches are it's like literally two bites. You literally. breathe and you're just like, fuck, they're gone. God, dude, in college, I in college our house was a mile away, so it was like a seven minute drive. Ooh, not even dangerous. And I used to I had a bad habit of finishing everything I bought before I got home. Seven minute drive. Shut up. And so I used to inhale. Tell, I used to tell myself, you have to wait till you get back to eat. Uh, because that used to be you. Nah. Yeah. Really? That was when I was like skinny though. Okay, okay. Because I just like you, you're in college, you have no yeah. money. So like yeah, it's, and quick it's trip so cheap. Might Those be sandwiches. your only meal, so it doesn't hit you wrong, you know. Yeah. It's just something. Your body's like, Thank you, fucking Lord. Yeah. There's chicken bread and yeah. And something. how Honestly, much does that cost? Like how much is a sandwich? Like two bucks? Yeah, two bucks. Yeah. It's like incredibly that. cheap, yeah, dude. True, you're true. almost better going there than McDonald's for some shit. It's dude, wild. Literally, yeah. Wild. Dude, yeah. Quick trip just took over. I want to see a picture of skinny Devo from college. I don't think I've seen one. Dude, we were just having this yeah. conversation the other day, dude. I have ever seen dude. one, bro. Dude, Friday, it's, it's, we uh, about this. it's weird. So, like, I was like, I saw something on his Instagram, and I was scrolling through, like, some old photos, because he mentioned when he was skinnier, and I'm like, I wonder what he looked like when he was tinier. And I was looking and through. And no facial hair. And I, yeah, and I found photos of him without the mustache. Oh, and and I, this is going to sound terrible, because we talked about it. I looked at those photos, and I was like, what a fucking douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But really, then, but then dude. dude, but, like, you realize he's the same dude. Nothing changed. And then you see a photo with him in a mustache. And you're just like, that's my best friend. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but without the mustache, you're like, what the fuck is that? Yeah. Who is this fucking guy? <laughs> like, what a dick. Yeah. What are yeah. you doing, Devo? Yeah, dude, I was skinny. I could never grow facial hair. Wow. And um, yeah, I just I was a runner. So I was just really into running and Gross. military. He had the jawline and everything. He looked like a pretty boy. Yeah, yeah. I he was looks always like a pretty told boy. that I was the frat Frat, frat boy, looking that dude, never yeah. Joined a frat. Yeah. yeah, I can't yeah. see it. I'm sorry. Yeah. No, it's wild yeah. though, I, dude. Take I, it, I, take I a chance. That guy. <laughs> <laughs> Someone pulls He's up a dead. photo. What happened to him? He's gone. He's gone. <laughs> Multiple. Yeah, yeah. That that was a different time. Your I was, I've lived through a couple <laughs> different lives. I would say. It's wild Had phases, but yeah, you guys rolled right into like your. You guys were big li- into it right out the lift, gates. Big yeah. into lifting way early on. Sixteen years old, baby. I was, yeah, Holy I was, shit, I really? Yeah. You competed at 18? Yeah. yeah. Holy fuck, dude. That's crazy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's young. That was... Did you know, like, when you started lifting, did you start lifting for bodybuilding? Or did no, you kind of learn about bodybuilding like, as you started? I was moron when I would, tr- would train, dude. Really? I, I would work out two muscle groups in one session every day. Like what? Like what, be, give, me, give me, like, your first day, like, chest day or some shit. Maybe, like, a, a chest... And back day, like a full chest day. Oh, it's like, yeah, and yeah. And a yeah. full back day. Like would be 12 workouts? That's I would be in the gym for Yeah, like you remember those six days? Hours. That's insane. When I think everyone went through that phase yeah. at one point. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, that's not just you. I remember that. Remember, like you used to work out for like two and a half hours. I and I was like, why am I not Twice growing? a day sometimes. Yeah. yeah. And you're like, why yeah. am I not getting back? I would, I would yeah. train at like fucking 6 a.m. before school. And then, like in, back in high school, and then I, right after football practice, I'd go do my own shit again. I'd really? do like a full yeah. chest day, and then come back later that evening and, and do hit a like, full leg day. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. just not doing like, dude, anything good. Did you ever like like go to the gym, get like a training session in with your buddies, go fucking fuck around after school, get something to eat, come back and train again? Yeah, yep, all, all the time. time. All We'd the like time. go down and play basketball, oh, no. go to the gas station, get something to eat, you know, go to track practice and shit, and then lift again we used to like lock we up were. the gym because the coaches would be like we can't be here till 8 p.m every night. yeah 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 god yeah. i wish i had that because all of you had a background of lifting in high school and yeah, i feel didn't. like that shapes people so well it's my oh, favorite it thing 
It's not because, I mean, dude, like, me you too. think about it, dude, you're a walking, like, testosterone booster at that age, dude. Yeah. Your you hormones, you're you're, dude, your dude, your entire, sure. like, musculoskeletal system is, like, expanding. You're growing. Like, you're going through puberty. Like, you're getting PRs left and right while eating chicken nuggets and french fries. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And I didn't touch a fucking weight till I was 18, and I was like, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> well, how are you supposed to know, though, you know? Like, yeah. was, but, dude, you I was just like, wish that. someone would Yeah, I wish, I wish someone would have just came up to me and, like, just called me a fat fuck like right. i wish that's like dude i know like i wish that driver, i wish that's i had that driver. dude like if you get like shit talked and things like that that's a big dude like my friends would like yourself, fuck man. with me and shit like i'd get scoop slapped with my tits and stuff like that and like i just yeah. wanted to be i knew i was kind of fat because i was chunky too but i had such a strong base but if you were lifting because i just though, wanted to yeah. be i was like but you were I moving can't weight hurt you if you're strong yeah <laughs> but you yeah you lifted weights yeah got really into it and that was that's all we look forward to. I would sit there at school just like, come on, a couple more hours, a couple yeah. more hours. Yeah. Hell like, I would get off of uh, school at like 2.30, and I would get worried because I'm like, dude, I need to go to the gym before they close. So I See, dude, like I, and the gym closed uh, at like 10 because so, yeah. I was there for so long. I, I like, wish I had that mentality at that age, dude. I was like petrified to go down the hallway that was by the weight room in the locker really? room. Really? Why? Was you dude, I, dude, I dude, I was terrified of it, dude. Like, I was like, I'm fat. Like, I'm out of shape. I don't know what I'm Damn. doing. If I go in there, I'm just going to get fucking roasted. Like, dude, I used to have buddies, like, sophomore and freshman year that were like, you want to go to the weight room? And I was like, ah, oh, dude, I got shit going on back at home. Yep, and yep. I, like, by 345, I met a lazy boy playing Modern Warfare 2 for like well, the next six <laughs> hours. That had its place too, though. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. We all, I mean, but I you guys Call like, of Duty like a motherfucker too. But you worked out. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't do any of that. No, dude, there was like. Wait, so when you started lifting, you like started doing your shit. You didn't. Uh, like you said, you're like, your training was like, you know, two muscle groups at a time. It would be. When was it? Like then you started like learning, like, oh, this is actually a thing I can learn and then compete. Was it like a year later? Uh, Did you I, want to do a prep just randomly because somebody told you about it? Or I like, think it was like how'd you get into the bodybuilding three, side of it? Three or four months I've been like doing like a yeah, quote yeah. unquote like real off season, um, and then we just like did the show right away. I was skin and bones. I was like one seventy on stage. Wow. Well, what's kind of crazy is my last like <laughs> wait for my. <laughs> That's what I'll be. Fuck. <laughs> That's what I was. Such a little bitch. Yeah. That's what I was, dude. Yeah, but. Yeah, my stage weight like didn't really change too much from my last show from my first show, which was kind of wild. Nice. Um, yeah, but the uh, your second show, you looked pretty fucking good compared to the first one, right? Yeah, you made yeah, a lot of progress. I, I just, I'm, I, I had no idea there was this side of the world. I guess you kind of grew up a little more in like the middle of social media. Yeah, because right, like, I was right se- when it just. I'm started. seven years ahead of you, so yeah. Like, we didn't have that, so I didn't even know really. I didn't know bodybuilding was a thing. We just lifted for football, yeah, yeah. and that's it. Yeah, I didn't even know there was other avenues outside of that until like, like junior year of college. Uh-huh, like uh-huh. then I started noticing it. I was like, oh, there's a lot of bodybuilders around here. I remember mm-hmm. back then I would get more of like a. I loved lifting for like seeing how strong I was getting. Oh yeah, and it was more. It wasn't more so like how I looked visually. Hell no. It was like I wanted to move fucking weight. Yep. I wanted, wanted to, to not, be the guy. Yeah. I wanted to eat a shit ton of food, and then then I started to like get stronger. And then my body's like, "Whoa, what the fuck? Like I have a roundness on the shoulders. Like what are shoulder muscles?" And then it was like the physique was changing, but like the strength was addicting to me. Yeah. Like I always have. Like even to this day, like sometimes I'm like, I'll get to the gym, and there's something that makes me want to fucking like just move some heavy squats. Right. And it's just like it's from how like my training stemmed when I was younger. I feel like I feel like that's how it should be through high school. Though, I think dude. I think it's extremely like, important to get strong right away. You should yeah. really like I like how you talked about how you had that coach in high school. Yeah. You, it's like more. I wish more kids had like gym yeah. teachers like that because like I had a motivational gym teacher my senior. Year. That's why I got into lifting was because of him. But we didn't have a guy like that to just show us like the basics, like to bench, squat, deadlift. Right. We didn't. Our gym teacher that was there for like thirty years was like cross country coach. And, dude, he was skin and fucking bones. Yeah, 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 it sucks. That's why I was telling you guys I when I was talking to my old high school about going back and doing that. I wanted to so bad. Yeah. The pay is just so bad. Yeah. Yep, yep. But you just want to go there to instill that you in those You could volunteer, kids. like, yeah. on a Saturday. Yeah. Like, a yeah, few hours of, like, a seminar time and be, like, promotion to all athletes. Like, But yeah, yeah. I see why it would be hard to promote Think it. Think about though. how many kids. At that point, I don't care, though. You Did know? you start getting into <laughs> training in high school or, like, <laughs> freshman year of high school? It was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. 
Yeah, I remember like training in like seventh and eighth grade, just like the fucking fuck? around doing arms and shit. Yeah. Well, my dad had a uh, squat, like a full actual like Smith machine oh, set up in the basement. Yeah, oh, you had so one of those in middle school. I would go down there with him sometimes. Yeah, okay. Get after it a little bit for sure, for sure. So it gave me a base, and then going into freshman year, I kind of understood it a little bit better during our during our track season as throwers. So like our throwing coach was also our football coach. Yeah, he would like during um, home track meets. He like after like the meets going on, the weight room is closed up and everything to the public. He would like give us the key after we were done with our throws and shit. And he'd be like, "Yeah, like it's gonna get you better. I can't have you. You're on the football team. I can't have you not train in the off season." Yep. So he'd like open it up just for like six of us, and it was just like us six were the fucking just like next season crazy because like we yeah. had a five month period where we could train and nobody else was. Yeah, yeah, and it was just cool. It was cool as hell. We would try to be like. We would hold competitions on like who would be the strongest, and yeah. we would brag about that shit. Dude, same. Like yeah. The more. moment I hit three fifteen in high school, bro, like oh, people, yeah. people, people, are like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> what are you on? And I'm like nothing. I feel like if you squat Jesus. like three fifteen in high school, people like you hit three fifteen bench in high school. I was a freshman. You benched that? Yeah. I no thought you squatted that. No, at, at the end of my freshman year. Jesus Christ. Freshman no year, you benched 315? Yeah, at the end of my freshman year. What the oh, fuck wait. do you mean? I benched 315 at the end of my freshman year. Are you what serious? No way, yeah. dude. Dude, uh-huh. no I way. I thought you were skinny as hell back yeah. then. Dude, I was strong. What? My stro- some of the wow. strongest lifts I've That's ever impressive. had. That's yeah. impressive. Did you, your butt you, come you, off the you bench? You immediately no. went squat. Zach. I swear to God. <laughs> I thought squat. Yeah, squat. I thought squat. No, I knew. I remember. I saw something in his eye and I was like, no. I was in gym class. I'm like, we were like writing goals out and stuff. Stuff for like what we want to do, like, and I'm like, I'm gonna bench 225. This year. I, want that I, I benched 225 bitch. literally two weeks later after doing that. I'm like, I'm gonna bench 315. Hit 315 a couple months later, and I like my buddy was down playing basketball, and he was like always a strong, like more stronger than me, stronger than anybody on the football team. And I like hit 315. I like looking down there, like these massive windows, looking down at the gymnasium, I'm like 315. He comes up there, like fails it. I'm like, let's go. It's <laughs> like a villain. Look Damn, literally, like I'm like, fuck like, yeah. Got that's it. That's impressive as fuck. Yeah, that's crazy. crazy. I hit 350, uh, I think, my so- yeah, in the middle of my sophomore year. Yeah. If you saw anybody Holy in cow. high school bench 315 ever, you were like, what the my fuck? My PR freshman year was like 185. Freshman, yeah, I think I hit two, two plates freshman year. Damn it. I didn't hit two plates to fucking strong, college. <laughs> I hit two plates for one. That was back in your like max out days, and you're hitting it for oh one. My I wasn't God. hitting it for reps. Can't imagine what my form looked like back. Oh, in my Jesus, dude! Oh, I think yeah. about it sometimes, Jesus. and I'm just like. Ah. And I used to go <laughs> to the. We walked around that whitewater gym like we owned that bitch. Ah, oh, dude, I loved it, Jim. It yeah. was such a good gym, though. It had all hammer strength, play loaded yeah. equipment. They they had a great gym. Whitewater's gym is a great. Gym. Yeah, it was phenomenal. We just yeah. lifted in our college gym. Were you guys allowed to wear stringers? At your college gym? Fuck no. Hell. Really? We weren't. We weren't. No. Why? no hats. You weren't at point? What? Really? No hats, no uh, yeah. no cutoffs. Why not? Nothing. Bro, I don't know. They said it was a sanitation thing yeah. and a health Bro, thing. Bro, it's a gym. They said that for ours, A lot too. of colleges, really? dude. Yeah. Dude, the moment. Things aren't getting cleaned as much either, so. Yeah. You, know. you got to think the, the volume of people going through that facility. Those football players and those wrestlers, dude. Yeah. yeah. Those wrestlers would come in with, like, nothing on, yeah, too, true, and they would get yelled at, but, like. They have so many skin things going on, yeah. dude. Yeah, you're yeah. right. Yeah, there's too many athletes all working out. In my there. Se- my senior year of college, Keep they, they finally let the like the, let it pass at Whitewater. Oh, did they really? They were like, "Yep, you wear stringers." Yeah, wow. That was the first time I saw like a bodybuilder. They opened it up for for a little bit, and this bodybuilder was in there. We called him Superman because the dude just was a men's physique god. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, "What the hell is that? <laughs> How the hell is he that shredded?" But I didn't understand steroids at the time either. So, yep, I exactly. just I just assumed these dudes were fucking shredded and yes, stacked. And I was all like, the time year round. I was like, too. "God damn it, genetics are a son of a bitch." Yep, you know? yep. <laughs> and then I find out the dude's just blasted. Five hundred pounds. <laughs> Five hundred trend. I would have never guessed. They go what? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Google Maps on his arm, like. Yeah, I had no, well, dude, I was as so a naive kid, you're so this. unaware of like I used the to look amount at of the people that world. use it, like celebrities, athletes, all of it. I used you're to look at like, that bodybuilding magazines all the time, yeah. like Target and shit. And they and then Get my depressed. And, no, and then my <laughs> my dad one time was like, they're all on steroids. I was like, no, they're fucking dude. Oh, I would do the same thing. My dad. I was like, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Not Jay dad. Cutler is yeah. using his Jay Cutler yeah. way. I saw it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Help me gain 35 pounds of pure muscle. <laughs> Dad, I know I've, I don't have my birthday coming up, but read I need his, I need his read creatine. Read the label. I need his whey protein. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> That's why I'm not getting back. And for only two forty nine, I we can do Bro, it. I wouldn't buy so many supplement shit scams <laughs> like that. He goes into the room with my mom. He's fucking retarded. <laughs> <laughs> what am I gonna do with him? <laughs> You're in your bedroom doing curls, looking at the Jay Cutler post. I've gotta get the protein. I've gotta get it. <laughs> earn the protein. Earn the protein. <laughs> 
Dude, I would, I would, I was such a supplement <laughs> fiend back then. Yeah, dude. Oh, dude, dude, I thought oh, supplements were the I had, shit. Oh my, I, yeah, dude. I just deleted a picture. I scrolled <laughs> way back in my camera roll when I first got an iPhone. It was in the high school locker room, and we laid out all our supplements on the bench and dude, took up we a would whole do that. bench. Yeah, and we took like we did like a photo shoot of it. Like, Shut up. <laughs> we're like, we're like this summer we're getting huge. And it's just like, it's like pictures dude, it's like of just dudes like, with like vials, creatine. <laughs> no, we thought we were so cool with just like Walmart. <laughs> Branded yeah. fucking, oh, I can't remember what the protein was that was from like Walmart. Was it Nutritech? Something like that. That no, weird. Oh, tech. that's you remember that one? Yeah, I remember that one. Ours was like Muscle Tech or something. Yeah, like yeah, that. yeah, yeah. That yeah. was a big and one. Then yeah, you had all the Optimum Nutrition from fucking Optimum the, Nutrition yep. was like the minute you found out GNC <laughs> was a thing. <laughs> exactly. Yup, yup, yup. Gold standard. The Arnold. Because you the saw Arnold Steve Arnold Cook one, using though. it, and you were yep. like, "I'm gonna get looked like that." Yep, yep. yep. Dude, the, the Arnold <laughs> protein powder too. The oh, I never had that one. Oh, yeah. Remember the big green one? Yes. No, I Arnold never had Signature that one. series. Yeah, yeah. Oh Dude, no, yeah. That was yeah. the first protein I ever bought. It was with Cellucor. It was a Cellucor. And then they, they came did out like with, an Arnold series. They came out with the animal packs too. Yeah. Oh, those hit. Like, yep. It'd be like strength gaining <laughs> animal pack, and it's just 800 pills. <laughs> you just pour out in your hand, and you go. It's like all it's right. Like, it's like creatine. It's like fucking like uh, glutamine, and then just omegas and stuff. And yep. you thought it's gonna be the holy grail. I would like use that. I would actually like consider that like a I'm cycle huge. i would be like all yes. right i got a 30 day Bro. animal pack i gotta eat healthy this cycle i gotta yep. treat it right <laughs> dude i would say the same i would i would do, I would do the same Ridiculous. thing with creatine like, i'm gonna cycle off creatine and, you know i'm gonna yep. chill for a bit now i'm back on like i would literally talk like i'm running did you cycle. guys do a yeah. living phase when you first started taking oh yeah, no, yeah. I, I, dude, no I, 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 I never did i never 15 did. grams <laughs> oh my fucking, god I've never, I've never done it just like eight <laughs> scoops a day because they said if you didn't load in the first five days, yeah. it wouldn't work as well. And that was at the time when they would say cycle off. So they would yep. do one month on, one month off. Yep. Yep. So you got to load in that first week. So you get three good weeks of muscle growth. Because <laughs> then you're coming off it. Oh, my God. It was ridiculous. Dude, the shit. Oh dude do you guys, uh, do you remember that brand? Uh, it was like Beast Creatine, the blue one. Yes, dude. dude that still I, tasted uh, amazing, though. Yeah, dude. I remember they had that. And it said on the thing, like, you have to take it pre-workout. Your yes. strength will go yes. through the roof. And this was when I was, like, just, like, first working out. It was out. creatine. The first time I put that shit, like, in a blender bottle, I was, like, waiting for everyone to leave the locker room. Because I, I felt like I was basically <laughs> doing, like, a pin in the yep. bathroom. Yep. And I put a scoop of it in my pre-workout. And I shook it up. I took a sip and I was like, I'll show these fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, had dude, a, I had a like, a, like a weird placebo effect. I went in the weight room that month on that shit and I just like walk around my house and I just be like, something's happening. I'm transforming. <laughs> I could just see you in the locker room. Yeah. Just, like like the Spider-Man. Like, dude, like, I thought I could like see fucking venom crawling through my forearms the first time I took it. I was just like, I will no, not be dude, picked on anymore. It was weird. You, you, like, you hit it from your parents. Oh, you hit it yes. from your friends. Yeah, dude. dude I thought they were going to like judge me. You guys you remember BioGrow? That like the oh, the company. It was like CT Fletcher was like sponsored by them or whatever. It was like they made these. It was like a scoop. It was like protein peptide, like faster absorbing protein synthesis yeah. things. Okay, there was crazy hype about it, and it was the same thing. Like I'd be like, oh yeah, it's a peptide, it's a protein peptide. Yeah, dude, that scoop it, bro. And like I had my football coaches like, hey, we heard you're on like BioGrow. What's this BioGrow stuff? I'm like, oh, this is what it is. They're like, they th- th- legit thought it was like. Something bad, you know, but like we took it all so seriously. Yeah. Like we got called Dude, in because sometimes people the are so uneducated Dude, about I, supplements. Bro, people people would say they would like see us taking steroids. It would be us mixing pre workout. I I, didn't, I like wouldn't tell my no parents. bullshit. I'm not kidding. You. People we used so to come dumb. to this supplement warehouse right over here, the one that you worked at, Zach. Yeah. We used to come to that in high school. And drive out all the way out here from Brookfield and not Holy tell our shit, parents. Wow. Like we would sneak out and then we go in there and be like. Wow, this one says it's gonna make you shred it in a month. <laughs> like, I'd be like, Man. dude, you read those things and got so fucking excited. You're like, if my parents but catch so me with this, nervous. yeah, dude, dude, you would save up for that shit. Yeah, yeah. I would save up my money. I'm like, okay, dude, fuck, yeah, I got six more dollars. Let's go. When you guys remember the original Jacked, Jack 3D, I never, never got to oh, try it. Never, never got to never try it. Never it was, got to try it was straight cocaine. Yes, really? it was, it was yeah. and so it was fucking it nuts. Banned? They used amphetamines in there. Yep, yeah, yep, like yep. they had all this shit in there. Same and thing with the original Kraken. So, yep, yep. Yeah, and so Ooh, it they they made the announcement that That's it was it now illegal, be. and Supplement Warehouse was like, hey, "Come in and get a tub for five bucks." So we went and we bought them out of Jack 3D. Because we would take that shit. We'd drink three scoops Holy before football shit. games and before lifts. Dude. 
Yeah. Your heart was yeah, insane. Ticking. Yeah, dude. So we'd puke sometimes, but we didn't think it was an adverse effect. We would just be oh like, no, it can't be that because I'm just juice. But you're like, it's because I'm going so hard that I'm puking. You're but like just vibrating really, at the hands. Wow. And as a kid, you're just like, this is what, this is what yeah. it means. Dude, I relate to that. When I, I took used that to feel Kraken, so unhealthy. I used to take that. Cr- would you sweat after you would take it? Like, yeah. Crazy? Dude, oh, probably, I would take Kraken dude. before like school. I'd train in the morning, stimmed out of my fucking mind, like tingly, numb. Yeah. I'd, get, I'd, I'd shower. I'd change clothes by second class my entire back was sweaty and like i'd have to change clothes midway because i would just my, my body's still psyched off this pre-workout our middle just linebacker bro, i would have cold sweats i would have cold sweats first half of the day our middle Jeez. linebacker would take yeah. two scoops per half shut up oh, fuck and God. there was some games, that's like a thousand milligrams of there caffeine. were some games where he would like black out for like half the game Holy and shit. just be like on autopilot and he'd be like i don't know what just fu- fucking happened <laughs> and we'd be like you're killing it out there bro like you're, 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 you're like 40 tackles like he was oh. he was a monster bro that the, the focus on like, that stuff was nuts yeah but he would but be you're like, caffeinated out of your fucking one mind not just caffeine we're a mess bro Dude, we, we almost got in a fight on the sideline because he had a huge sack and he came running off and he was so juiced up and he didn't know where he was and he went to go headbutt me but i didn't have my helmet on Oh, and so he just headbutted the fuck out of my nose, and it was just gushing blood. And oh. I'm, like, I'm like, you fucking idiot! He's like, I don't know where I am. Oh my god! <laughs> what? Yeah, he would just be so juiced up on like four. Ooh, that had to have hurt jacked. so oh, bad, wow. dude. Those dude, helmets like, are. Fucking I literally was like, you're a fucking idiot, dude. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that is nuts. Oh, I would have been so pissed. What you guys? Have you? What, did you have any football injuries? No, no. I was I was rock solid, dude. No, no. no. But you didn't play football the last tough. two years, though. I didn't last uh, year. Yeah. Oh, last year. Oh, you didn't play your senior year? No. I was right. too busy being a bodybuilder. Yeah, I was just going <laughs> to say. You were living that shit. God damn. I yeah. wish I would have played my senior year, though. Senior year, though. Cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> Go, I wish I would have played my senior year, though, because I was like 230. Oh, yeah. shit. Are wow. you kidding me? I was, I was fat, though. Wow. Was that after was your second show, right? That was, yeah. That I was, was dude, you're, you were, fat. Bro, you were so much. Imagine you're, you're 230 right now, right? Yeah. Fuck, dude. Hell of a recomp. Four years ago, <laughs> you being 230. Hell of a recomp, he says. <laughs> that's insane. Yeah, dude. It was crazy. You were a yeah, that's... I, popped, I, I had Pop-Tarts in my locker, though. I had like Jesus. four boxes. Do you remember when you used to, in football, have to like eat PB&Js between every class? Yes. Because they oh, yeah. told you that would get you huge? Yep. Did you ever do that? I would do oh, that. I, that's what Jay Cutler said to do. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. When we, heard, grill, dude, when we heard... Dude, when we heard that, we were like, yes, sir. This is going to sound fucking so dumb. Before lifting, I would take a protein shake. And I put a whole packet of oatmeal in that, down it with my pre workout. Like, pre workout would be separate, but I'd like, they just told you no, I told just, you I had to eat. Yeah, yeah. That's what I do. I just like, the oatmeal would soak it up, and I would just be chugging that shit right before training. The minute I heard that yeah. PB and J's grew muscle, I, <laughs> and that I had to eat one between yeah. every class, I would have six of them a day. Dude, Holy shit. <laughs> you were going through a loaf of bread every two Damn days. Damn near, yeah. Wow. And, wow. And you'd have lunch, and you'd have breakfast, and yep. you'd have dinner. And then you'd have fucking you six. You have an iron stomach. Six PB and J. Seems so impressive. Because they would be yeah. like, they were like, if you want to get huge, you eat one of these between every class. And yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I'm like, yes, sir. Were <laughs> <laughs> they was... the Uncrustables or did you make them? No, I would make them. Oh, hell Did no. you guys ever have oh, like probably the so kick back in high school where, you know those massive fucking sandwiches from Quick Trip? What are those called? Like, they're, it's a massive oh, sub yes. sandwich. Oh, no, 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 no. It's a massive sub sandwich. Um, fuck. Sub the... sandwich. It, I can uh, see it's it. Like not a giant dude. What the fuck's it called? Uh, fuck. Monster. Gargantuan or something like that. Dude, something like that. Yeah, would, I remember like I, w- I was so focused on just eating whatever the fuck I get my hands on. Before a football game, I'd eat a, like probably half of one of those massive yeah. sub sandwiches. After the football game, I'd eat half of that and get another half from dude, Quick Trip. Like, it's crazy how similar. I would do the same 64 thing. 64-ounce Gatorades. The, the sandwiches were like fucking... Huge. Yeah, they were, they they were probably like this a, long, dude. They were like a yard long. Yeah, you yeah. Just mouth that. The coaches thing. would get us cousin subs before games. Oh, that's that's awesome. That's yeah. kind of a plug. Oh, yeah, that's that's nice. yeah, yeah, for sure. They would serve us dinner. They would. Yeah. We'd go in right after school, and all the moms would have it set up. Oh, we've had that. And yeah. then they would give us like this huge dinner before every game, and you we just had pasta out. nights. We had pasta nights on wow. Thursdays, so like. Before game day, yeah. Oh yeah, so for we sure. We were just mad because our coaches would fun. say, "Make sure you carb up." I think it was. Cater- God, I think it was. There was something to be too. said about Friday Night Lights. Fuck yeah, <laughs> dude! I I miss that shit, dude. You guys are taking me bet down that rabbit hole, of thinking like the pre the pregame meal. Yes, and dude. then you listen. Then you go. What and, song? What were your pregame songs? Pre-game I, songs. I had all the Eminem like Fuck songs yeah. on there. That I was just be sitting there one. with. With the beats over yes, the years, dude, like yep, the huge yep. beats back in the day, yes, and just be like rocking. You get your meal and you just be walking around. Did you guys ever have like a, a team song where the entire team would get fucking lit to that one song? 
I, if we, we did, I can't remember. We had we had these massive fucking speakers in there, and like we would bring subs in, dude. Like we would have yeah. subs. We'd connect subs. We'd have like a bunch of fucking outlet strips and shit. Yep. But uh, we our entire team. You know the song "Can't Be Touched" by like Roy Jones. Roy Jones, yeah, yeah. yeah Roy Jones. Yeah. Absolutely fucking nuts. The entire team, and then we go out to football se- football field, get fucking raped. We just Dude, oh, I mean, we just get fucked. We never lost my senior year, so we were really a, we were we were on another level. Like, Damn that those locker rooms would get intense. They're like they're not gonna come in here Wait, tell us and break the streak. I sucked. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> okay. Fuck you, mean, dude. I was fat. <laughs> I was I was good at one high school sport, and I yeah. wouldn't even consider it like a sport. It's more of like a skill, and that was golf. Oh, true. Yeah. Golf is hard, though. I can't. I can't golf. Dude, I'm he's, so he's happy. A hell I of a bowler, it. too. We got to go. Dude, he sometime. definitely is. Yeah. yeah. At I like like I said, dude. I was fat, so I was good at like all non physical sure. contact sports. Yeah, but that's not a huge reason because I was fat too, but I chose sports sports. Yeah. Oh, no, I still played, like, uh, the one sport I was actually pretty decent at all through high school was baseball. But then when yeah. I got into golf, I, I – orig- it's going to sound so fat. This will tell you why it's I was so fat. so fat. No, dude, this is why, <laughs> like, I, I was so bad. Um, senior year – or, like, when I was a freshman, the seniors were, like, trying to recruit freshmen to join the golf team because they were going to cut the program at yeah. Chilton because it didn't have enough people going out for it. And, they, like, one of the seniors came up to me and he handed me a flyer and he's just like, hey, man, you want to join the golf team? And I'm like – golf i'm like i i think i got a set of clubs and i was just like ah but dude i was like summer sport we probably gotta like what like fucking jog around the golf course or something and he's like dude it's golf you can walk (laughs) he's like you just walk and i was like so no running he's like no running (laughs) dude and i was like dude no seriously i was like sweet i can i was and dude and i knew this about the golf team that they got out of class for all their meets because golf events start early in the morning yeah so when you like you know how you when you guys would get out for like a football game maybe a little bit earlier two o'clock maybe yeah yeah, but like you only have like like and it was a treat dude when we got out for golf season we had um 10 matches a year before like uh conference tournaments and stuff we'd get out the full day you would show up to school in your like golf uniform you'd sit down at like 8 a.m like show that you showed up and then you immediately walked to like the team bus yeah, yeah, yeah. and you got out kids. the whole day you were done golfing by like noon one o'clock oh, and you could go back to awesome. school but then every golf event that you travel to like like how the clubhouses have food all the time You'd eat like a big pulled pork sandwich or a burger or whatever they would host Dude, for a meal. I missed out. And then yeah, you'd dip geez. from that and you'd get to leave from there and it would be like one o'clock and coach would be like, You can either go back to school or you can fucking go home. Like you're out for the day. And now you were like, All right, well, we're just gonna go golfing again and we're gonna go for free. Did you ever yeah. have those teachers that like absolutely hated the fucking sports teams? Yeah. That was the one they hated the most yeah, for us. Really? Because we got really? out of Dude, my math teacher, because I sucked so fucking bad at algebra. Yeah, yeah. Like I remember Mrs. Spore would just be like, Lance, you can't keep missing. You're already doing really bad. <laughs> and I was you just, suck at golf. Just come to class. Just sitting there just like I was like, I was like, Mrs. Piece of shit. I was like, I just need a C. That's it. I was like, <laughs> my parents don't expect much, and it that's all I need. <laughs> like, I was like, my other grades are good. I just need a 3.0. As long as I got a 3.0, they were not mad. Yeah, they didn't yeah. my parents didn't require me to get like honors at like like high honors they were like you just get a 3.0 it's a b average yep. uh, yeah, you're golden yeah. just show us you're competent for sure for yeah sure. so they hated golf because we got out the whole fucking yeah, day dude. Yep. Yeah. it was awesome awesome dude man i'm, re- I'm and it was free golf you literally and yeah, you always got fun. to play with a partner so it was you and one of your buddies and yeah. i always got to play with my buddy taylor wolf so we'd get to go like you're wearing a baggy polo you're wearing fucking comfy khakis golf shoes and you're going to play a fun game for four hours with your buddy and you're eating gummy worms chewing sunflower sure. seeds just having a great time. Oh, for sure, that dude. Fun. Now I really want to do golf. Dude, and the best part was is we I didn't care sometime. about it. I actually it, want to. But yeah, like the more I played it, the better I got at it. So like by senior year, because I originally joined it just to be a lazy fat fuck, I actually got like better at it just because you'd play every fucking day. Yeah, you're bought in now. Yeah. 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 For four yeah, years for sure. straight. And it was free. So in the summers, whenever the weather was nice, my buddies would be like, you want to go golf? Because we didn't have to pay because we were on the team. Oh, nice. I think after going yeah. disc golfing, that made me want We're going to play that a lot more. Yeah. I feel like yeah. after dude, we did that, was a that hoot. I feel like after we did that, I really want to go like actual golf. Yeah. yeah. No, for sure. And I liked at the end how like we were all like, especially you and me, we fucking sucked. But we were st- starting to get the hang of it. Yeah. yeah. You know? The more consistent and, like, we it, go. It got me excited. Like I was like, dude, I kind of want to go through this course like another time soon. Dude, right. the funniest yeah. part of Frisbee but, golf yesterday by by far was when we all realized how supportive of a group we are. Dude, we did not talk shit at all. Yeah. No, we dude. We were awesome. Oh, God. <laughs> Somebody really like, nice shot, man. I'd nice throw one at the tree and Tivo would just be like, next time, kid, you got to hook it Literally. around. Stay Literally. a little bit lower. <laughs> and I was just like, 
Oh, that's exactly what I'll do. Every <laughs> nice shot somebody would take, Lance would be like, beautiful. Nice, man. For 10 seconds until it hits the ground. Dude, He's it, like, yeah. beautiful shot. Beautiful I've shot, never man. played Excellent. it in like a group, so watching like a good throw, you were like, oh, that's kind of fucking sweet, yeah. dude. Yeah. You just threw but it through dude, a bunch of trees and you almost hit the net. That was dope. But so dude, watching Devo watch. throw, yeah. though, was like, dude, everybody was when like, he hit that I shot, you were on. When he yeah. hit that fucking <laughs> shot over that just little... Oh really my god! Crazy. Over the river! Oh, yeah. that was so sick. That was yeah, sick. Was the life. fact that you sniped that one too. The, oh, maj- the a- one majestic shot. He's just like slow literally. Motion. I really enjoyed that moment because it never happens, and oh, I know yeah. that I know oh, it's it not perfect. Easy to believe, but like I'm so bad at it. So yesterday I was like, I enjoy this. So you so <laughs> good. <laughs> yeah, dude. When you play good, you want to play again. Yeah. yeah, for sure, for sure. A hundred percent. Yeah, that was elite. That was yeah. insane. Just getting outside. That's the key. All right. Dude, I miss fishing. How did we get down that? So I don't know. Dude. Let's Jesus move on. Christ. Let's talk about some phone notes. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's slide it I up. Did, I didn't take too many this week. I've kind of had an up and down weird week of being busy. So I'm going to let you guys kind of take I the floor. One. Does anybody have like have one. So, you You want to go first? I have one right away. I want to hear it. I saw it this morning. Let's hit um, it. it was an Instagram post about the Neuralink being approved by the FDA. So for those of you listening that don't know what the Neuralink is, <laughs> Zach, you know, do you know how to explain it? I know like bits and pieces of it, but I feel like you're a lot more educated on the topic. So go ahead and explain. So the it real quick. Neuralink is like, um, it's like a chip that goes in your brain or something. Mm-hmm. It's gonna That's allow fun. you to have like absorb hey, knowledge Google guy. and shit. <laughs> yeah, so yeah you, pull up the Neuralink. <laughs> pull up the Neuralink. Oh yeah. Uh, Lance, you're gonna have to get him in. What's your uh, password, Lance? You, Tell everybody. Lance, uh, Apple. <laughs> <laughs> I have I have a reason for that. It's, I have a reason. It's a Mac. I swear. Apple. What could it be? Apple. You said that just so confident. <laughs> Apple. So, someone goes, <laughs> dude. Someone goes oh, it boy. couldn't be. That's too simple. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude. I had to get it cleaned out like a year and a half back, and they were like, we had to reset the whole thing. So you they uh, they were like, we changed your password to Apple, and you can go into settings and edit it. And I was like, I ain't fucking doing that. Talk, no. That sounds like a lot. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, that's a whole rabbit hole of time I got to dig into. I was like, it's a good password. You're our Jamie for the Joe Rogan podcast. Jamie. Dude, literally. What do you got? So here it says there's a Neuralink Corporation in America. Where it's a neurologically company that is developing implements in the brain. So like things no that go in the brain. Way. From what I've heard, like you'll be able to hear a different language. I don't think it'll be that right away. It's no, not right not away. But like this is what Elon Musk has said he wants to kind of like develop. I don't know it why as. we were trying to look at his little screen from all the oh, way yeah, up. Yeah, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> I didn't. Dude. <laughs> huge, what were we doing? The huge TV. Where I'm squinting like, what does it say over there? <laughs> <laughs> I keep reaching over. I kept doing that too. I was <laughs> the like, TV's right here. Hey, buddy. Can you say it? <laughs> For the people in the back. <laughs> what, like, what does Neuralink do? What does it say? No, no, no down. <laughs> have a what huge 65 inch TV right here. Building an implantable squinting. brain computer interface capable of translating thought into action. See, the problem that's with this, scary as fuck. What the fuck are we talking the about? The phone right? thought, though, the problem with this is we, we're not educated enough Dude, the to really talk about this. Yeah, yeah, we don't know what okay, it's going to be point, at, no. at first, you yeah, know? No but I think, I think it's scary. This is just me. Like, I don't, yeah. I don't know. It's, I don't know. You don't fuck with the brain. Crazy. Bro. You don't fuck with the brain. Well, but they're saying it might cure like Alzheimer's and stuff like that. And like, Okay, yes, I think like that too, yeah, from what I've heard, though, yeah. too, I think that stuff like that is fantastic. I think that's a huge but that's asset to society. But that's what's being made for for right. now. Exactly. And then later we'll see what the... Because I think there's always going to be somehow it's going to be like something's going to... Adverse sides or whatever. Or there's going to be some malfunction. Someone's going to yeah. hack your brain yeah. and you're going to be like, fuck, now I'm a Russian. The government can just off you. Just yeah. fucking... Uh, that's the button. thing. Yeah, what if they just <laughs> press that off button? I'm like, okay, delete. I don't know. But, but what you, you didn't have it though? before. The FDA approved it, though. That's big. <laughs> that is big. That's nuts. That's why I wanted to talk about it, because I was like, wow, this is getting close. Dude. <laughs> I'm con- you know what they should bring, it, bring, uh, bring back is cloning. Dude, what? They, have, they have cloning. That what? shit's wild. Devo, they have cloning, bro. Yeah, that's 100%. Just... They've cloned humans. Uh, they've cloned fucking Dude, they're doing animals. it with dogs. Um, yeah, you get it 50 grand. This company what? Is, yeah. This company, you can clone your dog. I think it's in, like, your... I can't remember <laughs> what? where it is. No bullshit. Aww. Yeah. You can oh, clone your dog. That's so, a thing? So, yeah. yeah. Bro. What the fuck? It's going to be a different dog yeah. because it's not going to have the same experiences. You can f- but it's wow. going to look exactly the same. Yes. That's insane. And that's the crazy it's part. It's kind of scary, dude. They clone my, humans, bro. When something if... passes, I don't want to see it again. No, like, no. It's like you went through dude, the morning, leave it. Dude, that's like the people it. that get their dogs stuffed oh, when they die. Shut up. That's a thing. Yeah, people do thing. that. No. It's Terrifying. Are you talking Hell slow no, dogs? Dude. Are you talking Hell no. dogs? <laughs> I would cry every day. every day. Every day. Every day I would be depressed. This like, is a le- legit I'd thing. People are just fucked. My Imagine explaining. Yeah. Yes. Hey, that's a real thing. Imagine what? telling some- another uh, human. Like you guys came over no. and you're like, oh, is that your dog? Oh, he's not moving. 
And I go, that yeah, was my stuffed. dog. That was that's If Zeus. you told me that, we wouldn't have associated after I that. Yeah. Well, imagine if you guys came over for the first time. I would happened. have never come you over. Would we wouldn't friends. be here. Yeah, no. We wouldn't be here. Never be here again. Because you're fucking weird. Yeah. Wow. And you're any, dark. And any you're listeners, dark. Any listeners who, uh, like, are... They have. They're into that thing. I'm sorry. You're fucking weird. You're fucking weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's just gonna say I'm not it. saying sorry. You're a sick it's, fuck. It's a little too much. Hey, <laughs> hey, 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 we don't alienate anybody, Lance. What As we, we do, about? it al- alienate them. You stuff a fucking animal, damn right, dude. Unless it's it. like, well, actually, you know, with hunting, does that kind of? Yeah, but that's you're not different. attached to that's the animal, different. though. Yeah, you that's a trophy. It's not like I pet. It's not like I pet that deer on the back. You guys want to hear a crazy story too? Oh fuck yeah! One of my friend's neighbors. Or no, Aaron. I think it was Aaron. Aaron's neighbors. Yeah, their son committed suicide, and oh. then they adopted a dog and named it the son's no, name. No, st- that's oh. different, dude. That's no. some shit where like white people end up getting white haunted on a documentary, you, and that's something you, no, they no, totally that's, would that's do. That's the kind of place you go to stay. Like the, your car breaks down and you stay there, yeah. and they go, "Oh, that's Daniel." And then you go, like, that's they say, my son. the fuck, yeah, dude? After my son. And then that night, yeah, you hear him scurrying around in the walls and shit. And you're dude, like, fuck. Dude. That's what I'm saying. That I is like an immediate, that that's, that's an weird. immediate where you're going to go into a house and feel like a strange presence. Yes. Yes. You're going to be on edge the weird moment. Shit. Yeah, they People are, are fucked up. Yes, dude. That's imagine, what, imagine you get all your dog stuff. Like imagine oh. you have multiple dogs and they're all just like. People are like that. Did you guys ever watch that interview? You got a burn in that home. Swear. Wait, you want Beyond Scared Straight? No, the intervention show like on uh, MTV. I can't remember the name of it, but they used to just take these people that were like addicted to the weirdest things. Oh, and, my like, oh, my strangest like addiction that. or some yeah, shit. Yeah, 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 um, something like that. I've seen some gross ones. Yeah, on I know there. exactly. Yeah, there is yeah, some yeah, disgusting yeah, yeah. fucking. Yeah, that show stuff. you'd watch it and just be like, I've seen people eat shit on that what show. What the dude. fuck? Yeah. It was no. There's literally an episode because they talked about it on the Joe Rogan podcast one time where he really? was like gagging. And there's like a girl like eating her shit. <laughs> yeah, she would eat around it. She would cook like around it, and she yeah. hoarded all what her the shit. Fuck? She kept all her. You shit. imagine that's your kid, dude? Oh, dude. you imagine no, that's your that kid? And that same girl, the mom was that way too. What? what? Yeah. <gasps> that's some genetic stuff, <laughs> yeah. dude. Imagine dude, growing up around that. You're missing. Imagine shit. going to class as like a 14 year old, and all of a sudden you just like you pull out little nibblets of shit that you're snacking on, and some the kids kid like, next "What the you. fuck are you doing, <laughs> bro?" Goes, He's like, like it "Smells like shit in here." <laughs> oh, dude, my mom's been feeding me this since I was like six. It's amazing, bro. What's that's up? nuts. You have shit in your hand. I'd dude, be like, "Kid, you gotta." You gotta that get shit put reminds down. me of like those serial killer documentaries. Like people went to high school right next to these kids and yeah, they're going true. home and murdering animals at night. Dude, I don't Fuck like yeah, I don't, they are. I don't like Fuck yeah, they are. You're like, wow. I don't like I don't <laughs> like next to that kid. I don't like how they keep making these uh documentaries about serial killers. It's I mean, I, I think it's creepy. It's good to know. It's fun I don't, though. I don't think so. When you watch it, you get like a sickly like fe- feeling. Oh, like like yeah, the yeah. Dahmer do- or the do- not the Dahmer I, oh, documentary, yeah, th- the do- Dahmer like recreation. Yeah. Do you, I got three, uh, yeah, three episodes sure. in and I couldn't do it. It's hard to watch. Do you Dude, guys um bad. remember oh, fuck um so that was I remember so freshman year, remember when Kim Kardashian like tweeted out in college about like uh what's uh, uh Stephen Avery? Do you guys remember that one? No. The documentary about like how he's innocent and all that shit. It was a huge thing on Netflix. Going to How do you guys so, not have dude, seen that one? That, no. I that's a huge so. one, but no, no I, I, it, uh, I, I, the court case happened in a, in Chilton, and that's like the only thing we're known for. Really, freshman, oh, I remember that. Yep. Freshman yep. year, my phone got blown up because yeah, Kim Kardashian tweeted about it, so then everyone went to watch the documentary about Stephen Avery, and the Netflix documentary depicted it so fucked up. They were like, "Oh, dude, he's like, he's like, he's innocent." Blah 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 blah, and he's like in there for life. And in Chilton, uh, we overheard one time that like the head like sheriff who like over saw it was like dude that motherfucker is never getting out was it, was it really like dude they made that documentary so one-sided and it like the whole town was like pissed about it really yeah dude because Damn. like um we knew some people who were related to the girl that like got murdered Pre- and like so people briefly, were pissed about it for the people like that don't know about this um documentary briefly explain like what what What's this, the scenario? Like, what, oh, what, dude, what it's, happened, it's like, just some dude that had been accused people. of um, other murders. He was, like, associated with them, but never, like, proven guilty with any of yeah. them. And then he was also, like, known, I think, and, and don't quote me on this, if there was, like, some animal, like, killing involved in there, too, like, habits of that. Wow. But he, like, brutally murdered uh, a girl, and, like, the court case hearing was in uh, our hometown, and it was, like, a huge thing because, like, my mom and dad knew people who were related to her. And I remember because my phone started blowing up with like people in the dorm that were like, oh, dude, 
like, did you know that like this court case happened in your hometown? And I'm like, wow. yeah, I'm like, but like people don't really talk about it in town because like he's not fucking it's, innocent. And that documentary yeah. made him look like he did wow, nothing that's wrong. Bad, dude. Because like one girl from our hometown like would tweet it and she was just like, this documentary makes you want to think. And like every person from Chilton reached out to her and was like, you shut your mouth, you dumb bitch. You know that's not what happened. <laughs> dude, <laughs> dude, because like... We had like so many people like like chatted about it, and they're like, "There is so much evidence that he did this." There's like, there, he's still in prison today. You know wow. Like yeah, he's not getting out. Like, what's some evidence that was like for sure? He dude, they didn't be, talk about it at to, all in the documentary. Yeah, yeah you'd have to like look into it more. Yeah. But there's dude, a like, reason, there's, there's a reason they don't he's put that in, shit in a documentary. Yeah. Though, dude, too. the yeah. amount of technology docu- they docu- have. Doc- documentaries are biased to like get that shit, dude. Like, there's a reason someone's sitting in there for life. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. That that's why the, the they're director, not guessing. The director no. for the Dahmer series said it was so hard to to write that show, yeah, because he didn't want people to feel bad. Good, yeah. because the guy because Dahmer was like bullied and stuff. So genuine, like generically, you'd be like, oh man, I feel bad for this kid. Yeah, he's like, I didn't Fucking want the crowd great. to ever be like, no, good. Give sympathy you know, good. Point. yeah, it's a good. murderer, so dude. That was the it's hardest someone part who killed about, someone, yes. dude. They said that was the, the hardest part about thing. the writing and wow. acting was that you had to depict it in a way that no one gives sympathy. Did you know? Oh, he dude, supposedly, yeah. supposedly, before um, Dahmer went to prison, he like, like completely transformed, like he like gave his life to God and stuff. Supposedly. Oh, oh hell no, yeah. dude. Trying you killed excuse. people. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, you people. bit bitches. You bit bitches. That's fucked eight, up, isn't it? Eight people. Eight people. Eight Think people. about, is that... It goes, but yeah. I found... Yeah. I'm thinking, I'm thinking of the dude bad. that... Uh, How that fucked up is that? He yeah. bit the people, right? Or am I thinking of a different one? No, he no he, no, he, he ate bit them. and he ate them. them. Like, he but he bit people, yeah. Which one am I thinking of where... Is he the pretty boy? The one that like yeah, tried the to defend dude. the, the, the dude, dude that no, tried no, to defend no, himself no, no, in court. Or am no, I thinking no, no. of a different one? No, you're thinking of the other one. Um, oh, the dude who defended himself escaped, in court. He escaped to the jail. Yeah. Dude, yeah, who is this? Fuck, Zac Efron played him in the movie. Uh, the fuck is his name? Ted Bundy. Ted Bundy. Ted yeah, Bundy. Ted Bundy. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. who I'm thinking that's of. I'm is. thinking of Ted Bundy. That's fucked up. That, that's that one's Ted crazy too. Documentary like he went into that. Uh, so, uh, not fraternity. Um, a sorority. genius killer in sorority. Florida. That's and why like, he got caught, bro. Yeah. He literally would have gotten away with all those murders if he didn't bite someone because they had an outline x ray of his teeth, dude. Yeah. That's insane. Think about that. That's why you got like, caught because you bit someone. Because you couldn't dude. help yourself. You just had like to bite him. You're an absolute fucking lunatic. Yeah. Yeah, that was wild. I forgot that's how they figured that out. He bit a bitch. And they matched he the bit a up. bitch. They were like, what if? And they were like, no way. Think about that, dude. The, the, the slipper fit. <laughs> that's that's crazy. Yeah, yeah, because he had like a certain thing with his teeth. I don't know what procedure, whatever it was, but yeah. they like they lined him up and they were the exact same to another one. I would fucking just. Why are you biting people, dude? dude? And then my teeth out. And then when what he, are you biting people technology for? Technology was so bad back then that he just jumped out of the courtroom window to escape and made it all the way to Florida for months before getting caught again. What the fuck? Yeah, you gotta, dude. You got to watch bro, that he, documentary. It's you haven't crazy. seen that, dude? He yeah, runs crazy. up into like the woods and like lives there for dude, a time frame seeking. and then somehow gets through a border. They shut down like like highways, like doing like mass, like TVs were going through saying like, crazy. you're not getting through the state, but he somehow like, made it to Florida. He made it to Florida. Nothing. Incredible. He made it to Florida and couldn't fucking help himself. And had to kill and one more time. Yeah. Had to that's do it insane. Again. Wow. I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. dude. That, again, why well, he got caught. He wow. bit a chick. He wow. bit a chick. He was home free. They, like they people, lost him. I feel like people like those would never stop killing, though. No. And then Bro, he just dirt, I, I, and he had It's a probably a high. It's like probably loved. a high. Yeah. He's fucking people. And he had a girl that he loved, yeah. too. Like, And she loved him and didn't know he was like... He was getting off to that shit, man. Psycho. Imagine yeah. like all of a sudden one day the cops show up at your house like, and all of a sudden they're just like, by the way, we have to tell you something about your girlfriend. And you or your wife, and you find out that like the woman who raised your family has just been slaughtering, She's like eating people, and murdering. Wow! People. Yeah. You find out that like your backyard's buried with like people oh or some God. shit. You'd just be like, Jesus Christ! <laughs> what the fuck, nuts, dude? She comes home that night. Hey, sweetheart. Hey, did you guys ever watch that Ben Affleck movie where that girl, Which one? where he's dating that girl and she's like killing people, and then it's all getting blamed on him that he's like abusing no, her? Dude. No, dude. No, I can't remember that. it. It's a great movie though. She's crazy. Dude, she like I can't slits know. people's throats and like what? blames it on him. But then kind of new? he gets in trouble because no, it's old. He gets in trouble too. So then she kind of blackmails him and is like, "You shut up about me like Holy doing this shit, shit. and I won't say shit about you doing poor that." And then yeah, it's <laughs> no, wild. Poor Ben Affleck. Ben Affleck is <laughs> recommended good life. movie. Yeah. Lived, okay. Okay. He's lived a good life. Oh, I dropped my phone. Fuck. Um, Where are we at? 
Uh, Lance, you got any notes from this week? Yeah. Oh, yeah, shit. I took a screenshot. Let's go, Lance remembered. Yeah. <laughs> he did it. Let's you go, Lance. did it again. They said you wouldn't. <laughs> Alibi. You proved well, them wrong. All right. <laughs> first, first question. Um, and these are questionnaires that someone sent me. It's not really notes, I suppose. Yeah. Um, what's the worst name you could give your child? Oh, whoa. Ralph. Ralph. That's one of them. That's one of them. <laughs> Ooh, there's nothing short for I feel Ralph, like, okay, no. we have to do a, I feel like we should do a boy and girl name. Yep. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Emily. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> there's any Emily listening to Fuck that podcast. No. <laughs> no, I would say female one. Yeah, what's the ugliest name? Not, wow, I wouldn't dude. say ugly. There's, there's, there's like, not a there's lot of female be ugly. No, there's some female, not ugly, the worst name. My bad, the worst. Not no, ugly. There's, there's, some, <laughs> Jesus, there's some female names, though, that, where it's like two names put together. It's like, but it's like, it doesn't flow well. And I'm trying to think of those ones. That's the worst name in that category? Like, that's where you're going towards? I think so. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Well, I'm trying to think of like. Ralph was like, a good where one. Where there's like Jeremy. two first names as their first name. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm trying to think what that would be, though. Ralph, yeah, that's a good one. I don't know any Ralphs, really. No, but it just sounds like not great. Like Wreck It Ralph, that was a great movie. Oh yeah, it was a very entertaining movie. <laughs> yeah. I love that movie. Is this a dickhead thing for me to say for this name? Let's because pass it's this short, one. Like we're William, piss someone off, dude. Oh, I, yeah. yeah, I can't think of. I can't hey, think you of call him old Dick. <laughs> 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 All right, what's the other one? What's the next um, one? What sport would be the funniest to add PEDs to? Dude, yes, this is a good debate. Golf. I think baseball. Funniest? I think baseball would really just take that, off again. Nobody that gets be, hurt. That would be fun. But what you said, funniest, right? Women's basketball. <laughs> just juiced out chicks. Just yeah. Androgenic <laughs> women on the court. <laughs> he goes, yeah. <laughs> I think funny meaning like I think it would bring more like entertainment yeah. too. Okay, well, then I'd baseball, say baseball, would be baseball, baseball, baseball because baseball and then bump the fences back another hundred. Hockey feet, would huh? get dangerous. I feel I like know. though, dude. Like, and you can't do it for like you know fighting it's or football. Prevalent in football. Yeah, yeah. true. Hundred yeah. percent. Yeah, three. I w- I wouldn't be surprised if it's prevalent in hockey. Yeah, when you see them retire and they shrivel up, you're like, yeah. Yeah, dude, dude, seriously. Weren't on some? Dude, imagine the amount of bats that would just be shattered. Oh, yeah. But, dude, that's when fun. baseball was at its, like, yeah. peak. When, is they, when, dudes when they were, were popping saucing. D-balls before yeah, games and bro, shit, bro. They were homers sell, dude. <laughs> People want to watch a ball get crushed. I mean, yeah. it's a slow game otherwise. Entertaining yeah. as Oh, dude, fuck. it was so, so slow, slow the other week. Dude, the Sammy Sosa, Mark McGuire era, that's when it was like Barry Bonds. Barry oh Bonds, God, dude. Yeah, dude. Barry Bonds loved his D-ball. They were all bro. fucking juicing and just pounding just out homers. Yeah, bro. Dude, like that's a good crazy. MLB season now for home runs is like 35 to 40. You're crushing it. And back in well, – Aaron, Aaron Judge changed that last year. He got like 62 or whatever. Um, but Stop. back in the day, dude, Sosa, Bonds, and that, I think like Barry Bonds get like 70 homers in a season. Oh, Let wow. me look that up, actually. Wow. I'm going to Google that. What's a lot supposed of to be a Google guy, season. but... Lance said like currently we're on 35. 30, 35? Yeah. yeah, that's pretty good. Apple. Dude, the Giants were smoking home runs on Friday. Yeah. yeah. They were, it was nuts. I mean, if you're... He's fucking a team 15 to 1. Yeah. You, you're you hitting some bombs. Were you looking up, Lance? I was looking was up the time, most dude. home like runs Bruce in games. an NFL season. Yeah. I think it's Barry Bonds, and I think he had like 72, but that's me guessing. Home runs in a season right there. Yeah. Barry Bonds. 73 in 2000. Ah, I was wow. off by one. Damn it. A career to 762 home runs. Wow. Yeah. Good for Mark him. McGuire. Okay, Just okay. crushed it. Hank Aaron, 755. Albert Pujols at four. That's good stuff. He's good. He's fantastic. A-Rod's at five. Holy shit. Type in Barry Bonds on steroids. <laughs> <laughs> Is he just juiced or what? He's a thick I, I, dude. I he was see. a thick dude. I don't think he was ever like his shredded. batting. No, he wasn't. But he could just, just turn would get his big hips and into just, a bat and yeah. fucking crush it. I mean, you're imagine his oblique strength. He's a thick dude. He's a big guy, though. What's this guy? Go yeah. to the go to the, go to the picture to the left of this that one. That was him prime juicing. Look at this one. <laughs> when he had the elbow sleep. Look at his fucking forearms. Oh damn, it's so small. Oh no. Oh, oh no. pop ups. Ah oh, shit. Oh, you blew it. Come on, Zach. Get your fucking shirt. Oh, right there in the in the Under Armour. Got one job. In the black shirt in the black. Uh, yep. Yeah. He's jacked. Yeah. Thick dude. He's on Thick some dude. shit right there. Thick dude. <laughs> Zooms in. <laughs> yeah. Heck, dude. That's a big boy. <laughs> well, look at dude. Baseball players' forearms are stacked. Yeah. Look at his biceps, dude. <laughs> the Mark McGuire photo with milk. <laughs> <laughs> dude, you remember those got milk ads? Oh, my gosh, yeah. Yeah, you just had them all oh, around wait. school. There you go. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that. Right. <laughs> 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 I got to pull this up when I'm editing it. 
in in the age the of hell? pharmaceutical, come come pharmaceutical comes a hero for today. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, dude, that's Christ. hilarious. That's that's too much. That's rude. What other questions do we got for? Um, I dropped my phone on the ground. Can someone bring the Instagram up? Uh, <laughs> I got the Instagram. I'm losing it. My bad. You can pick up your phone. I mean, there's ca- there's all these cables. I don't want to rip any out. Oh, so just, I'm frozen. <laughs> I'm frozen in place. Dude, Ross yeah. won the uh, Cali Pro. Yeah, we saw. Yeah. Oh, that was in my shout notes. Shout out to Flavor Gang. Hey, guys. yeah, shout out Flavor Gang. Um, but yo, that was in my notes. Who do you, okay? Do you know? Do you guys know who Tony Burton looks like? Like, kind of r- what his shape is right now? No. Uh, I was gonna say like Tony Burton's shape versus Ross because Tony just won New York. Well, what? what, what Oh, pull up, pull up to uh, Cali I thought Pro. you were like about to tell me he looks like someone or reminds you. Of oh, someone. no, I'm so, I was gonna say, like, that was in my notes. No, I like, know his shape, his shape's great. Oh, yeah, yeah. Can I use Instagram on here? I don't know. You might um, need to log on. Um, but the big thing is, Ross, I couldn't believe that. And Ross then, blew away. His and conditioning then, uh, was it blew wild. Me, it blew my mind. Um, seeing like Sergio and uh, and uh, Stu fall. I know, dude, Sergio's a big dude. Did, how did they end? Was it was who was three four? Oh, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it was. Sergio, I think Stu got Sergio four. was three. Was he? Stu, oh, okay, okay. yeah, Stu Sergio, got four. Oh man, that's just tough for Stu because he came in even better than his Dude, last I know. one too. Yeah, yeah, that's great. You should look at his back double. Wow, good that's the one that's impressive. Dude, he's got a one way ticket to the Olympia now. Yeah, dude, good. He for, was good, screaming. Good for Ross, it, dude, he bro. was pumped. Did you see his hype? His, dude, uh, yeah, that was sick. Look at that Look shot, at bro. Those legs. Ross looks absolutely nuts here. Good for him coming out of the woodworks. And being oh, like, nah. Yeah, wow. especially because last year his his show was fucked last year because the night before some crazy stuff happened. Yeah, that and he what Antonio just came off a big win, so yep. he goes, "I'm gonna put, I'm gonna show this kid how to really, really do it." But wait, dude, when when uh after after Ross comes out, hyped as shit. Did you see? Uh, did you see Tonyo just like? Happy as fuck. Yeah, he was him. pumped yeah. for him. He, yeah. he, he fist bumped him, dude. He was like, Yo, dude, like, it meant so much to him. Yeah, that was so yeah, cool. Was I screaming. like that shit. When you can tell that, yeah, you you really on, you get excited for them. You see how much it meant to them. For sure, yeah. So shout out Ross. I think Ross well deserved that. They're both going to the Olympia now. Um, <laughs> what else we got? We got Noah asked, go to training genre, favorite muscle group to lift? Back. Back. 100%. Oh, dude, back. I love legs, man. Back or legs. It like used to chest. be legs, but I just love back now. Back, back or legs for me. Um, tra- training genre, music genre. Depends on the day. Uh, sometimes it's yeah. EDM. Sometimes it's hard rock. Really? Sometimes, yeah. yeah. You listen to EDM sure. when you're training. For huh? sure, dude. I, it gets sometimes, you pumped sometimes. Sometimes I just need that like... Wah, wah, bah, really? Dude, I like the fact huh. that like you'll just be in the middle of a set and you're just like going to failure and just you're... Boom, boom, boom. Oh yeah, yeah, and yeah. And you're just like, oh shit, all right. <laughs> and there's no words, so you're not getting distracted. Yeah, by that. you like, just, just lock just into the noise. sound and like, yeah, the noise. yeah, for sure. It's just stimulating your yeah. Fr- yeah. Then or, there are days or, I want to hear a dude like eat a microphone, going like, dude, yeah. I'm, I've been heavy. I, I, got, I go through fuck. phases. <laughs> <laughs> just screaming at the like, fucking dad. Like you're gonna brush this white. <laughs> I go through, I through, go through like uh, music phases when I'm training. Like right now, I'm, I'm in a screamo phase right now. Right. Yeah, big yeah. time screamo. Yeah. It's a blast, dude. You lock yeah. into that shit. Because yeah, sometimes I'm cruising you need some now. Just I just trap. Yeah. It's because yeah. I'm a fucking a bitch right now. Dude's yeah, been cruising for nice three days and just goes, "I'm losing." I, so I gotta listen to crazy metal. I'm daddy, you fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it. Um, uh, what yeah. about you, Zach? Probably old rap. It's old. You oh, look so like Tupac, an old. Huh? You look like yeah. an old rap I love rap listening to old guy. Tupac. Yeah, yeah, not gonna lie. Old Wayne's good too. It's just waves. Yeah. It just depends on the day. Yeah, yeah like same. how the day went. If I'm coming in with good vibes, I want something a little lighter, a little bit more upbeat. Yeah. If I'm coming in a little pissed off, I either need some like someone yelling at me, or something that my mind is like melting. And then if I'm coming in just kind of pretty chilled out, it's like I could do old school. For rap. sure. For sure. Yeah. Dude, l- lately this gonna, be, this gonna be weird as fuck. Lately, like some days going to the gym, I won't listen to like crazy hype up music anymore. I'll listen to like, bro, no bullshit. I'll listen to like classical where I don't have that like hype ass adrenaline rush. Because when I you're when I start, classical. bro, I'll listen to calm. You listen to like gym. fucking Mozart. Or something? I'm not kidding you, man. Because like I don't I don't get super psyched up. My heart rate doesn't get elevated, and then I hit the gym. And once I started just feeling like excited, did you train, do that because Justin Mahaley made it. a fucking thing about I it? it. Yeah, I, I go exactly I like why it, you did it. I go full psycho. No music. I want to get yeah. I want to get revved up. You, you, yeah, dude. dude. I do no music. Are you kidding me? On the way, an unhealthy amount, and I'll get there and be like, you didn't let, there was not a sound. That wow. Day. I like calm and quiet, dude. Like, I, it happens to me all the time. Music. I'll yeah. get I'll drive thirty minutes to Metro and I'll get there and pull in and be like, wow, we didn't. I never even turned the radio on. 
all the time. Wow. Usually listen Creeps to the country the whole way there. You listen to country before training. Always. Do. Really? It puts me in such a happy mood. I get so excited. <laughs> yeah, you rolled in. You rolled in. <laughs> Lance Metro. just smiles. Nah, dude, I'm just car. like jamming to Morgan Wallen. He's I'm got just, a fucking straw. His, his I have OG I just get excited. On and he rolls in and I hear like. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Guitar so nah, Lance, dude. Are you the type it, of dude that listens to like the radio? What do you mean? Like in the car, like you don't plug your phone in. You listen. No, to I always plug my phone in, but oh, I love to do it. No, nah, dude, like I'll wake up, I'll have my coffee with me, and I just turn on like a nice, like soothing, like country, like banjo, like excited for the day. I'm not really? A country guy. Yeah, dude, I'm always I, listening. Dude, to I country. gotta be up north if I'm listening to country. My, nah, dude, I love country. Though. Once the sun hits, the winter's different. Oh, true. But once the weather gets nicer, dude, the windows roll down, just jamming. It's so peaceful. Yeah, I call that like a your like guilty pleasure music. Like what? What do you got? Like I like bluegrass. That's like my. I can agree with I that. I love that yeah. stuff. I can yeah. agree with that. I grew yeah. up That's like my that. guilty pleasure one that like when I'm not listening to rap or anything like hardcore What's like that. What's everyone's guilty pleasure music type? Do you know you said yours? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Bluegrass. I don't really know if it's a guilty pleasure, dude. It's just like when the weather gets nice here in country, dude. I don't but know. You want to drink it's, right it's after. It's the one too. where like. For sure. It's the one where people hear you listen to it and they go, really? Yeah, yeah. You yeah. listen to that, huh? I, I think, think okay, then country for me then, yeah, because yeah. I'm not country at all. Well, up north, I'd say I'd it. say for me it's going to be, I, I do like bluegrass, but for me I feel like my it would be like, what's it called, like alternative music. Okay. What yeah. is that? Like alternative rock. Yeah. yeah. Oh, like classic rock? No. No, no more so like. What's more alternative so like, it's not rock? called classic rock. It's called alternative rock. Alternative well, my bad. Well, then alternative edu- rock's going to be kind of like, like punk rock, kind of. Yeah. Like more so like it's the. Was it like the early 2000s shit? Is that what some, you're thinking some, of? I, I would say it's like 2000s. it's like the tens, the 2010s. Yes, the tens. Like, like uh, yeah. like Fall Out Boy type Fall shit. Fall Out Boy, maybe yeah. a little. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are good classics. Like old Falling in Reverse. Like Is that like kind of alternative. Green Day shit like that. Like, yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> would you consider Nickelback a little alternative? <laughs> Nickelback is Hall yeah, of Fame. That's Nickelback. what he is. Like, that's Nickelback's his, one of my favorites. That's his category. God, damn it, I should have known that. <laughs> Why do people Love fucking Nickelback. hate on Nickelback? You don't like Nickelback? Dude, it's all right. It's, you put on a, like a radio just, of his so music, funny. and it's like 50. You know what the worst he part had is? white people hypnotized. He dude. Did. He did, dude. Bro. He did. <laughs> At work, uh, my coworker does like music theme Fridays, and he did a Nickelback one, and I haven't heard his music in like years. And like, I'm sitting in my office just like writing stuff down, and every song I realize I'm just like mouthing like, the words to like every song and i'm like <laughs> i was like how the fuck do i know 15 yeah, of these in a row yeah, 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 <laughs> they're yeah. so simple they're all so yeah. simple you're just like writing down notes how the hell do we <laughs> wind up like this <laughs> some old lincoln park god, dude. Dude. <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> you're just like screaming it <laughs> oh my god <laughs> and the transformers brought that back hard yeah too. dude Ooh, yeah yes hard. it made it so much the better. end of every film you get amped Dude, what was it in the Optimus end of Is that Lincoln Park? Like, it was Lincoln Park. Park. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you you like hear dropped. Optimus Prime just giving his monologue <laughs> as yeah. it pans to the space. <laughs> yes, <laughs> you're like, dude. You're like walking on the air like, yeah. Yo. yeah. <laughs> you don't know what yeah, you're going to do. Just yeah. high-fiving. <laughs> what a good movie. <laughs> and Megan Fox. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> dude. What a fucking time. And your parents pull up to pick you up. And you're like, Literally. You're like, Damn. <laughs> You just uh, humming the song the whole rest of the day. Dad, you should have been there. <laughs> Dude, yeah. Oh, it's uh, funny as fuck. Yeah, and you got away from your family for like five minutes. <laughs> yeah. You're so cool because you're at that theater with no By parents. Yourself. Yep. <laughs> just nuisances. Dude, and nowadays, shit. when you see that shit, you go, fucking kids. Dude, <laughs> yes. But at the time, you were doing that same shit. Uh-huh. Like, Throwing popcorn at each other, just launching shit, <laughs> oh, launching shit into the crowd. That's yeah. I got hit now. I'd be like, oh, "Fuck did that! <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck was that?" Yeah. We'd launch it into the crowd. No one would say a word. You'd just be like giggling, like, <laughs> "Yup, yup, yup, yup." That's actually Terror. a question I wanted to ask you. I, I fuck, I should have pulled that one up. That was in my notes. Is when did you realize, or what was the moment where all of a sudden, for the first time, you're like, "Fuck, dude, am I getting older?" Like, it's what every, was the oh, first moment where you were now, like, when I yeah. was grilling out for you guys last night? I was yeah, like, <laughs> you were dad mode last night. I looked night. at it, my hands started shaking. I was like, what have you become? <laughs> you just like slowly see your sneakers turn into those white New Balance. The I'm New wear- Balance. <laughs> yeah, I'm wearing Sketchers. Yeah. I just I said, feel like your I shirt go, tucked in. Check these shoes, man. <laughs> my posture is so much better. You should try some out. Just, you know what's sad, though, is you have those slight <laughs> conversations. Oh, no. <laughs> Dude, I was driving around the neighborhood the other day, just like looking at like houses in like Elm Grove, and all of a sudden I like saw like one lawn where like the hedges weren't trimmed, and yeah, I was just like, nice I, in my head, I was like, clean that up. <laughs> <laughs> that in my head, I was just like, the whole neighborhood looks like you. you're making them look like fucking fools out here. <laughs> Dude, I was putting on. Uh, I wear the. I just started wearing 
the nasal like oxygen yeah. strips or whatever so it opens <laughs> up your pat and i put it on the other night on thursday and i looked into the mirror slowly like what the fuck <laughs> and i had a realization old? i was like what the fuck i, wow. have, a night, I have a nighttime routine damn God damn it put Wait, me down the, i'm done <laughs> do you think what was yours like when you had that realization that you're like that was like that, that was when was i was one? looking at like got the it. lawns I, got it. I literally like talked to myself driving i was just like why did that bother you Wow. Why did that bother you at all? I was talking about mulch <laughs> prices the other day. I was like, <laughs> that's such a dad move. Dude, well, when, like, like, that's we said dad. yesterday, it's when you, are when you get the house, I feel like that's when it starts oh, yeah, to kick in. Sure. Yeah. I'm excited for that, man. I Fuck yeah. Want, yeah. I'm excited for that shit. Yeah, we built a podcast studio in the basement. Right? <laughs> yeah. It's dope. Fucking sick. <laughs> <laughs> fucking sick. White guys. Yeah. <laughs> got a house and a podcast studio. Yeah. Yeah. It turned out great. Dude, well, I was talking to Aaron about it. I was like, if we continue this, imagine like three, four years down the road, maybe we have like an actual studio. And looking back so and nice. being like, oh, that was cool. We came from a basement. Yo, studio. for sure. That's going to be sick. And we had then, a great, like, first podcast area though this is yeah dude yeah, yeah. we're Seriously. spoiled right now we yeah. got a new shelf in the yeah. background I, I featuring Aaron, Aaron, aaron's Alpha? plug with this entire thing lance She's and i were talking so about much. it lance and i were talking about it on friday we were like i just called nick i was like let's fucking do it yeah. <laughs> and he's like if sexy i'm in let's and, do it bro. And, why do i why do i feel like that's all the conversation like it literally it was. Was. It was, was he was like, the exact he was conversation like, hey you got time to talk and then we're talking about some business i'm like Let's talk. Yeah. We, get, we get on the phone. We get on the phone. like, let's start a podcast. Yeah. Like, okay. And then, and like, we literally we're, we're like, like, let me talk to Zach. And let, me get the get, let me get the gang together. I'll and give then you an answer. For some reason, I was like worried. Like, I was like, oh, man, I hope Zach's convinced. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, he was texting <laughs> me about it. Yeah. I was in the moment I was, it was like, brought up. I was like, if, if Zach... If Zach says no, what do we do? Like, <laughs> Literally, dude, like, why yeah. would you say no to him? Yeah, no. Why he goes, yeah. I think that's a bad idea. <laughs> and then Lance over here just pull rolling through. with the punches. Bad, like, in, yes, bad investment. Good. Dude, I've been, well, we talked about it so many times, and then you two were starting that one up, and then we were just like, fuck, we lost him. And then, well, like, yeah. and, and like nothing, like we're not saying that it was bad, but like just nothing kind of well, came terrible. out from we it. You know what out. I mean? And then Zach was on the phone with me. Like I could hear how excited you were, like because you were almost. It felt like you were like trying to convince me. And in the back of my head, the whole time, I'm like, dude, yeah, you didn't even have to ask. Oh, I, for like, sure. I, for I sure. called him like, like I was he was do just a like, pitch. I hope Zach says yes. He's just like, this is <laughs> such a good idea. <laughs> And I, in my back of my head, I'm like, I don't see why he wouldn't. Oh. <laughs> in my head, though, I was worried. I was like, he's oh. going to say no. <laughs> yeah, he was he like, hates the <laughs> idea. Funny as fuck, dude. Yeah, dude. And then uh, he well, texted. You, put, you kept putting so much emphasis on it. You just kept yeah. going, yeah, if he says because yes. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. So true, then it true. was building up that yes So we felt chest. like, yeah, because maybe I, you two wouldn't want to do it. No, because yeah. in my mind, bro, I literally, I was like, I want to do it. I want to do it. But I, I was like, wait, are we going to use like Dumbbell Dork's name? Or I was like, I was like, I was like. Now what's Zach gonna think about this? Do you think I'm ditching him? Zach, like Zach I thought says, the same thing, kinda. Zach I, says no one puts a patent on the name too, so we can't use it. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, "Have fun with shit." Zach comes. Zach comes with. He name. comes to us with a contract. I will be the host. I will be saying this. Uh, this is how we're gonna run. I it. want ten k a year. <laughs> yeah. Damn it! All all commission. Five percent of everything. Sponsor commission goes to me. We can't afford them. <laughs> <laughs> we're screwed. We're out, boys. We don't have enough cap space. <laughs> Fuck you, Zachary. God damn it! Yeah, that was great though. What, what do you say we light up this bowl for? Uh, Oh yeah! Did you guys see the bong that we have? Yeah, yeah. I remember. You mean, uh, we need a glassware. We need. You want to repeat who's on it again? Well, hold on. <laughs> We're in the middle of a segment. <laughs> segment. Do, do you have any more questions for us? No. Oh, um, no. That was someone it. was supposed to bring up the goddamn Instagram, and no one did. <laughs> no, I did. Literally, it was. There was, there was... <laughs> No, because we asked him. We asked I him on there, there was bro. A couple other. <laughs> Dude, no. The moment you said that, See, it's Zach on. just started turning around. He's like, shit. He's like, fuck <laughs> about it. God damn it. Oh, shit. Uh, there was nothing on it. Anything else that you want to talk about on there? No. No, dude, that's it. That's I all thought we, we just. Ag- I thought I got ignored. I what, was are like, some, what are some? What are some some past ones? Uh, uh, ooh. We're at an hour thirty. That might be in the garbage. <laughs> Really? I oh, threw away all the paper. papers. It's yeah, on my yeah. phone. I just got to bring it we're up. Pretty we're pretty deep. Some past ones. Yeah, pretty deep. We're pretty deep. We're, we're at an good. hour 30. Yeah. I think uh, we'll call it this Closing week. segments. And then next soon. week, we'll yeah. put a bigger emphasis on the, the yeah. listener questions. Today was kind of more, yeah. Today, today was, was just, a fucking hoot, dude. Today was just, yeah. you know, yeah. talking. Yeah. I think yeah, this has been sure. our best one. For sure. Well, we won't judge until we listen to it back. That's true. That's true. Don't get ahead of yourself, boy. Calm down. Closing thoughts. Oh, we should try bash mouth before we go. Oh, yeah. We didn't even get to try it. Let's try that. Hold on. Let me hit. Come on, you old man. Yeah. 
Broken. Nice no, little the sponsor. The sponsor's just like first episode, and you wait until an hour thirty-eight. <laughs> <laughs> to those, if you're still, you should have been chewing it during the fucking podcast. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, that smell <laughs> is so minty. That's strong. This reminds me no, of boys, those, boys. It's this, gonna be really strong. Right these after are that. huge. This reminds me of those like candies that you would get at like a really. Oh, this is dense. Yeah, 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 like yeah. Wow, these are wow. Quite enormous. Jesus. Now it's just gonna be chewing on the mic again. Oh fuck, I'm gonna be jittery as fuck. Oh, dude, it like goo- it like goose. Oh, yeah. So minty. Holy All shit. you can hear is just us chewing. Bad content, Nick. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, these are these are pretty There insane. is a punch to that. Alright, everybody stop chewing though. Because all I see is is chewing on your <laughs> Get out of your fucking mouth. God spit it out. <laughs> The bass mouth guy goes, it's falling apart. (laughs) (laughs) Minty gum makes me sneeze. I should have said something. No, really? Every time I chew a piece of spearmint, I sneeze. No. Why the fuck would you put it in your mouth? Dude, it's so good. Every time I chew spearmint, I sneeze. I think it's gum. The the blue packs don't make me sneeze. The ice doesn't. Anyways, closing thoughts, Zach. (laughs) This gum is really good. That's one of my closing thoughts. (laughs) Jesus Christ. Make sure to use code D2. Yep. Um, it is so fucking minty. Holy yeah, God. dude. I can feel it through my nose. Like, this I feel is it. awesome. I feel like you should take that before it tops. <laughs> dude, yeah, it's like, no some, it's like some ammonia salt. Like ammonia. And you know the big thing about gum these days? One that you use a single strip, oh. it's like not too much. Or it's not enough. Yes, it feels agreed. like you don't have enough in your mouth. Yeah, yeah. But then two strips is too much. This is perfect. This is like pretty big. It's like, like yeah, I, 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 needed to, I needed to take it out. It was getting overwhelming, but it was really good. Yeah. The shit out of our sponsors. <laughs> God damn it. But my breath smelled like. Cutting that out. Dude, breath, my mouth, like, my, my breath, breathing right now yeah. is like. Clear. It's yeah. Bad. Dude, it's yeah, I know. This is Ooh. awesome. Like, podcast. I'm not congested. Yeah, dude, you get That's, sick. Chew oh, some of this you gum. You'll this open up. Bed. Chew this before bed. If no, it's got caffeine dog. in it. Dude, caffeine in it, you fucking A wipe. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> hey, if it's like 11 o'clock at night and you're struggling to get to bed. 137 milligrams of natural caffeine will surely put you to sleep. Good one, Zach. (laughs) These kids are already addicted, dude. Uh, Fuck fuck. melatonin. This is the new product. (laughs) There should be something like this where it helps you, like, we're not going to have a sponsor. We're not Take this before no. Thursday. We're not. They go, eh, think we're yeah, another we're way. pulling back on this. <laughs> Tell that one kid to shut his fucking mouth. <laughs> 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 we we get a new contract that says Zach that. isn't allowed to comment yeah. at all. <laughs> what part of that 120 word fucking essay did you miss? <laughs> he goes, where in there was that? I send you a box. You read a fucking line. <laughs> Just read your fucking lines. You tell that fucking idiot to say <laughs> <laughs> oh, Just Don't take this before bed. He goes, <laughs> he goes, Thanks, buddy. I give it a three out of ten. I go, God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> you tell that new fucking kid. <laughs> oh, okay. He's gone if he stays that way. <laughs> oh, you're, shit. You're drooling your shirt? Something, Is that dude. from the gum? I don't know. <laughs> That's a good call. Out. Anyway, Lance, <laughs> closing thoughts? Ah, this was a blast. Happy Memorial Day weekend. Thanks for tuning yeah, absolutely. in. Absolutely. Yeah, we've been going through those closing thoughts for a minute. Yeah. Uh, Dude, we all, it happens every time. What do you got? Oh, uh, nothing. Just had a good-ass time. It was yeah. a blast. Um, I'm excited Thank- to edit this one, put it up for you guys. Um, good edits on this one, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Great clips. Thanks, yeah, for, uh, thanks for sitting down with us or walking or doing whatever you guys are doing. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Leave a review. Uh, leave a review. Um, do all of the above, please, on our YouTube, Spotify, Apple Music, SoundCloud. Shout us out on your stories. Um, shout us out on Instagram. Anything that helps. Uh, we want to just keep getting in people's ears and having people come hang out with us, grow the family. Um, and then code D2 for Bash Mouth Gum. We'll catch you guys next week. Deuces. Peace. Peace. Bingo.